Hello there, everybody! It's me, your boy, Mustard. I hope you're all having a wonderful day today. It is Tuesday, the 26th of March, and I can't freaking believe how fast this month's gone by. Uh, I feel like I've blinked and it's, it's April. Like, what what's going on? What's going on there, eh? What's going on? Uh, we've got one hell of a stream lined up for us today. Uh, we're going to be going to the circus to go hang out with our fellow Silk Song enjoyers. Getting getting excited about Team Cherry's newest game that's definitely coming out. It's definitely coming out. Don't worry. It's definitely going to be announced in the next Nintendo Direct. I swear. I swear. Let's see who we have in the chat today. We got Arch in the early ratty gang. Hey man, good to see you. Great to see you. We got Stars. Hey Stars, great to see you. Early ratty gang. I like the little the little wiggly woo. The 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 tilde is that what it's called? The tilde the, the the wiggly woo. That's good. We got Dom. Hey man, good to see you. Good to see you, bro. Boulder Silk, the finest, finest silk in the land. Come forth and visit my tailoring shop, where I weave my Boulder Silk. Welcome, friend. Uh, great to see you, man. I hope you're having a good day. Fancy, fancy seeing you here. Fa 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 fancy, fancy talking to you right now. I mean. We wouldn't wouldn't do wouldn't do that. I mean, imagine imagine that. Anyway, let's see who else is here. We got someone. Hey man, good to see you here. And the exactly on time early ratty gang. You were exactly on time. Squeaked on in. Squeaked on in. Uh So today we're gonna be continuing our. Dark Urge campaign. Um, we last time we left off, we had done a little bit of exploring of the town of Rivington, which is in the outskirts of the city of Baldur's Gate. Um, we had a very close encounter of the Orin kind, which was absolutely terrifying. I wasn't expecting it. Um, yeah, we got we got a lot to do, but. We've spent so much time adventuring. So much time adventuring. I think we need a little bit of reprieve. We need a little bit of a reprieve. I need to go spend some time just goofing off. It's, it, it's been so serious all the time. I think we need to go to the circus. Gotta go visit the circus. Like Dom says, Circus Tuesday. Gotta do that. Gotta do that. Hey Mika, great to have you here. How are you doing? I hope you're having a great Tuesday. I says I have a booth set up in the video dojo con selling signed copies of Rat Race. So like, yes. Also, someone great to see chats working this time. Um, I I know, I know that you you just mentioned it, but uh, it's really funny. Literally, as I was getting the stream set up. I was just messaging you. I was good. I was literally just writing to you, being like, "Hey, if if chat's not working again, we can get like, like the alternative thing set up if if need be." Um, but literally, as I was typing that, you messaged in the chat. I was like, "Yes, we're so back. We're so fucking back." Um, free from the astral prism, released, released. I'm making trouble for someone, uh, someone else's chat today, lol. Yay! Right, we're gonna start playing Baldur's Gate. Let's get Baldur's Gate up. Eh? Um, let's get Bald. There we go. Okay. <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't turning up for a moment there. And uh, let's get. Let's get my little guy there. Yay! Um. Uh, Tatty saved you from the prison. Truly a joyous day. Joyous, a joyous day. Let's uh, let's descend. Oh, 
Good stuff. Right. Let's roll. Let's roll. I've been thinking about this all week. You have no idea. You have no idea how excited for this I've been. Actually, like, over the moon with excitement. Uh, I'm going to take my glasses off. That's how serious I am. Now, I do need to warn you, there might potentially be a very sudden sound warning. Um, I had a spider crawl across my desk earlier on, and it was, like, right next to my hand. Um, I promise I was incredibly manly about it. Very manly about it. But, um, yeah, just, uh, bear in mind, if I suddenly have a spider crawl near me, I am going to scream. Uh, the battle cry of manly men. I'm gonna, I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna scream. I've been thinking about drinking mayonnaise. Lol. Oh, me too. I'm very excited about chugging down mayo. Just big old globs of mayonnaise. Well, he's blind now. Now everything he touches could be a spider. It's true. It's true. So, before we head on down, down here. I'm going to heal us up. I'm going to use our Song of Rest. Because we're all actually quite banged up. I can't actually remember why. Um, and for reasons that will become evident, I'm going to briefly head back to camp. Because we're going to grab Karlak. We're going to grab Karlak, okay? Should mind my step. For reasons, okay? For reasons, I'm going to grab Karlak. Uh, Karlak! Karlak! Fucking shapeshifter. <laughs> she'll try to break our best asset. Our trust. Fortunately, she's no match for our second best asset. Me. Oh, she's so good. Uh, we're heading out, come on. I'm up for it, but your party's a little full. Okay, I'm gonna switch you out with... Uh, who am I gonna switch out? Yeah, I just want to. I just want to go to the circus with my girlfriend. Of course, definitely. I've seen Dom writing neat and tatty in the chat. I could go for some neat and tatty right now, bro. Holy, holy crap! Aaron's so good. Love her to have more screen time. Yeah, I hope she has more screen time too. Um, we're gonna leave uh, uh, at camp at least just for a little bit. Just for a little bit. Let's go. Yeah, we're gonna leave Lethal behind. We're gonna take Karlak, who I need to buff. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna keep a star in. I think taking Halson would be good. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll take Karlak. That's fine. That's fine. Halson gets to stick around. Halson's fine. He gets he gets to stay. Oh, Karlak's got the wrong weapon equipped. Uh, I forgot I had to throw her pike last time. Right, let's go to the circus, everyone! We're going to the circus! What's going on here? What's going on here? All this kerfuffle over missing red caps. Yes, we'd caged them due to unruly behavior, but as our rat cap cleaners demonstrate, most are perfectly harmless. Red caps are absolutely not harmless. They're absolute nightmares. Keep a sharp eye out. Red caps are on the loose. One's deemed too violent to work. And not one of these circus folks seem bothered by it. Replacing Lazel with Carla, just like with the love thing from earlier. No! I mean, it's so true, but no! Chaining Hounson to Dirge so Musty doesn't take him off the team. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Hounson's great. There might be some circumstances where we need him to leave the party. What's going on here? Please, go ahead of us. My son is a little nervous. Your son's a little nervous, eh? Gable! 
Gable the boy! I want to see dribbles, but I don't like the monster at the door. What do you mean? He's perfectly fine. What's this? Benji? He... <laughs> He's a principal sniffer? Absolute sniffer? You see? He's Benji! He's one sniffy boy! Principal sniffer! Alright, Montgomery. What in the hell is all of this? A necessity, good sir. The Steel Watch loves pretending sweet Rivington doesn't exist. So we have decided to protect you, dear patrons. <laughs> no need to thank us. You'll be allowed in once I've done this batch. Next! Uh-oh, why is he sniffing this? Hello, hello, and welcome to the Circus of the Last Days. The finest extra planar circus there is. <gasps> An extra plane of circus. Can we go? Yes. 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 Yes, we can, Carl. Like, yes, we can. Oh, she's so good. I've never heard of an extra plane of circus before. We travel from plane to plane, thrilling all, blessed to see us. From tempestuous Ginny to belligerent red caps, you'll find them all here. Why is a ghoul sniffing people? Oh, uh, this is Benjamin. Say hi, Benji. Mates! Benji here checks all our patrons to make sure none of you are vicious murderers. <laughs> Can't be too careful. But enough of this. The circus who, is a place of joy. And who would be a vicious so murderer? Come inside and forget your worries. Who? 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 Who could? Who could do such a thing? <laughs> All right, I'd like to enter, please. Not a problem, dear patron. Benji just has to check if you're a vicious murderer. Benji? <laughs> blood! Tasty blood! So delicious! <laughs> oh. oh well, that's a first. Usually I'd allow you in, but in these times, I can take no chances. Move along. No circus for you. What? What? No! No, 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 no! No, you gotta let me in, bro! <laughs> I used to be a killer, but I've reformed my ways! Oh, I'm way louder than the game? Okay, thank you for letting me know. Let me do a little adjustment. Sorry, I was getting very excited. There we go. There we go. Yeah, the game might be too quiet. Let me crank that up as well. Okay. How's that? We how's the uh the bird sounds? The bird sounds in the background. Right, I'm just gonna pick look through these dialogue options. But how can this guy not let us in? I'm not a threat to you or anyone else in the circus, I swear it. I used to be a killer, but I reform my ways. It's very funny. I've been hired, meet your new bars. I've been hired as a fire breather. So nothing catches light. Let me in or I'll snap you in two. No, I used to be a killer, but I've reformed my ways, bro. Oh, heck. I get advantage. Refuse the butler's kill command. How's it give me guidance? Easiest roll I've ever made. Easy game for babies. In, in all, in, incredibly easy game for babies. Incredibly easy game for babies. Oh, damned if I'm not a sucker for big eyes and a heartfelt plea. Very well. Welcome to the circus of the last days. Have fun and be sure to catch the star of our show, Dribbles the Clown. I am the single most convincing and charming person on the entire planet. Look at this! It's a circus! Wow! What does this say? The circus of the last days has returned. 
Roxy Dryad's Gin and Dribbles the Clown back with a new act. Exciting! Thank you, narrator. Incredible. Look at these people. There's so many people around. What's this? Zara the Mummy. Hello, Zara the Mummy. Uh, I don't understand what you're trying to say. I'm going to try and interpret her hand movements. Easy. Easy. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. I'm going to roll again. Rolling again on a DC-10 check? Oh. Oh, game! <laughs> Uh, nailed it! Nailed it! Easiest game I've ever played! Easiest game I've ever, <laughs> ever played! Too bad, too bad Dirge is stupid! It's true! You realise she is minor putting on face paint. She has them to sell. Face paint! Face paint! I'd like to see your face paints, please! Oh, I love her! I love Zara. What are these? Disguise kits? <gasps> oh. Oh. Wow. 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 Cover up your horrid face. Don't be so mean to Dirge. He's trying his best. We're gonna we're gonna buy four disguise kits. What are these? Face painting kit. The selection of face paints transforms the applicant into a vibrant clown, as if by magic. I don't need one of those. I don't need one of those as if by magic. Thank you very much. Let's try out these disguise kits. Oh, it acts as disguise self! That's really cool. Okay. Right. That is actually really incredibly useful. Okay. Maybe we do want to become a clown. Hang on. I'd like to see your face paints, please. Okay. We're going to buy one. We're going to buy one of these. They're quite expensive. <laughs> Maybe dressing up as a clown would be fun. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, hang on. Let me interact with Zara again. I want to get Dirge's lovely face in shot. <laughs> okay, we've got to buy more of those. we got to buy more of those. We've got to get one for every member of the party. Incredible. Worth every penny. Worth every single penny. Okay, we're going to sell off all of this crap. Catherick's Warhammer? Get in the bin. Or maybe we should actually keep Catherick's Warhammer. Yeah, we're going to keep that as our new door breaker. We're going to get rid of the hashtag Ratty Gang Bat. We're going to get rid of these helmets. And all of this armor. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. He's trying his best. Let's follow Step his eye out and eats the worm. Yeah. That's, that's how we want it. 
Okay, we're going to split these items up. We're going to give one to Halsin. We're going to give one to Astarian. One to Karlak. Okay, and yeah, one to Karlak. <laughs> Halsin, my dude! That foul shapeshifter Orin is like a scavenger beast, probing us for weaknesses. Do not let her shake your resolve. We we won't let them break our resolve. This is this is very good. This is very good. No more rat bat. Ratty gang and shambles. Someone was using the rat bat muscle. I'm sorry. To Sol's? Sol's lol? What's going on in here? <gasps> There's a bard! A fellow musician! He's a dragonborn. The ringmaster hired another bard. <laughs> Viola is going to be pissed. Look at these guys. Glingo, the trapeze master. Enjoying the show? Then you're going to love dribbles. He's about to perform on stage. <gasps> Dribbles the clown chat! Dribbles the clown! So much dribbling and clowniness. What's over here? Must be on my way. Dragonborn, smooch him. He's a red boy. Oh, I do like red. I do like red. It's a good colour for people. I like I like big red scaly. Dragon guy, look at this guy. What a cool dude. Hang on, I'm gonna try playing with him. Hang on, 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 hang on. Uh Can I can I join in with him? Yes! It's probably use a different instrument, so I send out from the other guy using a lion. <laughs> That's awesome! What a cool thing! I can't believe we're gonna see Mustard live on stage. We are? Gonna get me live up on stage? I'm gonna make an embarrassment of myself? Who's this? Zethino, the master of love! She's a fae! Mystical tre creatures that dwell in twilight groves and misty forests. They have close ties to nature and light nature. Not all fey are good. Incredible. I can't believe we're going to see Mustard live on... Yes. As one to two, zero Dragon Balls. It's a criminal, criminal issue. Criminal. Zathino? Womb. I have felt no peace here until now. Your eyes stir up. There is pain, endless and deep, but also devotion, blazing like the sun. You're in love, are you not? I <laughs> yeah, I, I, I do. I do love someone. Someone close to me, actually. You are wise to admit it. When it comes to love, vulnerability is armor. Truth, a sword. And trust, a shield. I pray you wield all three, Stira. Bring the one you love to me. I will look into your hearts and see if your love is eternal, or doomed eternally. 
I mean, this could be fun, Carl. Like, what do you think? Yes, yes, yes. Let's do it. Yay! Close your eyes, little ones. Be still as stone to earth. And remember to breathe. <gasps> oh, look at Dirge's fucked up face! Where are we? We're in Act 1! <laughs> I see you. I see the bond between you. So tender. So fragile. But do you see it for yourselves? Carlac. Her fire within can incinerate an enemy. Or warm a beloved. Listen. Think. Who does she loathe above all others? Oh. Either Zariel or Gortash, right? I actually don't know who it would be out of those two. Hmm. Zariel sucks. Like, Zariel is, like, horrible. But Gortash is the one who betrayed her. Yeah, I was gonna say Gortash. Yeah, me. Oh, she fucking hates my guts. Yeah, Gortash. Yeah, I think you're right. Gortash time. Just the sound of his name makes my blood boil. Probably literally. Can't stand the fucker. Ding, ding. Yes! Yeah, it's the betrayal from Gortash. How your bond thrums with pleasure. Strong, vital, pulsing with affection. Many things delight the heart, but only one makes it sing. Tell me, what is her idea of a perfect day? <laughs> Sorry, those are those are excellent options. Those are excellent options. I mean, Karlik is a well-known reader, well-known reader. So is it either sitting quietly reading a book, strolling through uh, through town, sh uh, window shopping, or bashing baddies interspersed with victory sex? Unironically, unironically, I think it's the third. Window shopping, probably. Yeah, no. Batching baddies intersperse with victory sex. You know me too well. Yes! So, so sloppy toppy on main! Awful! Loves dance lightly on the tongue. But they sag and suffer with age. The future brings many trials. A decade from now, what will the mighty Carlac do? Where will she be? <sighs> oh, fuck. I mean, she's... Probably gonna be dead. P probably. <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. As as much as much as I want number two, with all of my heart, it's probably one. Honestly, probably. But hopefully not any time soon. I've got a lot of living to do yet. <laughs> you 
You really know me, don't you? It's wild. In so many ways, we barely know each other. But where it counts, you're deeper in my head than that tadpole. How close you are. Two hearts beating a perfect rhythm. But I know the truth. Only one face haunts your dreams each night. Close your eyes, sweetness, and she will come to you. Oh, shit! I see how you slip slither closer, belly dragging in the filth. Father is... You waste time soft soothing these flesh bags for the knife. Do not worry, Slaughterkin. My blades are still sharp and sweet. They will greet you soon enough. What the shit? She's toying with me. What does she want? What does she have? Does she have red hair? I didn't clock that. Possibly blood? Fuck! She's so cool. I... Okay. Alright. Okay. Good. 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 So, all that nice romantic stuff she was talking about, about us being close and stuff. No, no, no. She... God. What a stinker. What a stinker. It's funny you ask, Arch, why does she have red hair? Because last time I spoke to the druid in my recent playthrough, one, she wasn't Arin, and two, she was red. Like, her, her skin was red. I think the druid encounter is somewhat... Not druid. Uh, dryad encounter is somewhat... Uh, bugged? They must have forget to disable the mod again. No! It's working exa exactly as intended. Exactly as intended. <laughs> Let's talk to Carla. What's on your mind? Aaron. Aaron. She scares me. Look at this. It's a spinny wheel. It's a spinny wheel. Look at all this cool shit. Wow! Wow! Worthless treasure crate. Those are my favorites. This isn't coin. It's paper. It's paper. What is this? Sapphires, polished necklaces, a gilded tome. A, a katana. Oh, we can weave it up. We can we can weave it up super well. Yay! Now Oren knows the answers to questions only Karlak would know. Perfect for impersonation. No. This guy's a genie. He's a gin. A Carby, the destroyer of planes. Hello. Approach, one. Bit rude. Arch says Oren would never commit identity fraud. That's illegal. That's true. You are very. <laughs> I like that he speaks in all caps. Incredible. I know a good set of pipes when I hear them, and you have them. Yes. Behold! <laughs> Akabi's Wheel of Wonders. Spin! To win prizes beyond your tiny imagination. And make your miserable life more bearable. Oh, because we we have a level in sorcerer, we can say your magic is potent. I can feel it from here. You must have some quite magical prizes. 
Akavi has traveled across the plains, burning and conquering all. Win the spoils of such conquest. Or, if luck smiles upon you, win the grand prize, the jackpot. A jackpot, you say? What is the jackpot? No more questions. Spin or don't. I mean, I think we've got to give this a spin. I'd like to spin the wheel, please. Let us see. If you have luck's favor. Say failed perception. Alas, no jackpot for you, ugly one. But you may have this. Th thanks, I, I guess. You are welcome, putrid one. Return again to try and you. The other hand of Vecna? Not as powerful as its sister. It still provides superior scratching capabilities. Okay. Um. That's very funny. That's very, very funny. For those of you who don't know, Vecna is, uh. a long dead. Lich slash god who lost his left hand and his eye in battle. And they are like extremely powerful magical items. Um, they're like full on artifacts. They are the physical embodiment of a god because they were left in the material plane. That's very cool. Yeah, we got knockoff magical items. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna have another go. We're gonna have another go. You failed to win the grand prize, but fear not, grotesque one. Try again. Be victorious. We will try again. We've got this. I'd like to spin the wheel. Yes. You will win the jackpot this time. I am sure of it. Oh! Alas, no jackpot for you, ugly one. But you may have this. Thanks, I guess. You are welcome, putrid one. Return again to try and you. What did we get, chat? Mirror of aging. Give this to a starian. This mirror will show you yourself as an elderly person provided that you look into it for long enough. Decades for preference. God fucking damn it. It's exactly the same cutscene, lol. I doubt we can ever get the jackpot. Possibly. Let's have a look at his ship. Gilded Tome. I'm going to interact with this tome. Why is this made of paper? All the ship. Helmet? Elixir of Battle Mage's power! Okay, we're gonna give this one more go. We're gonna give this one more go. Yes. The last prize I won was nothing but junk, bro. Your tiny mind has failed to see its true potential. Can I spin? The spongy mortal returns. Spin the wheel and change your fate. One more spin. One more spin. This time for sure. This time for sure. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks very much. Lonely left boot of elven kind. This is the left boot of the famous magical footwear. Unfortunately useless without a pair. 
I can feel the, the sunk cost fallacy uh, setting in. Investigate the spinner? No, it seems fine. A Starion? Can you can you go sneaky peeky? Oh, you can go sneaky peeky. It's a cheap imitation. Nothing more. It's a cheap imitation. Nothing more. It's just cheap tat. Passed off as the real thing. It's just cheap tat. Passed off as the real thing. Shit, it's all fake. It's all fake. So it's got some nice clothes, but that's it. Book of Cheezomancy. The Book of Cheezomancy by Mistress Bree Curdstrainer. If you come to this book today, I humbly request to I humbly request you to consider that the wild art of cheese magic is no laughing matter. Yes, indeed. For while one might amuse himself with conjuration of fermented milk through the veil. Curds can be a most dangerous tool. A cheesed can, of course, bludgeon his enemies with a young, vigorous wheel of uh, water davian. But those more subtle, in those of more subtle inclinations, will learn the benefit of destroying their enemies, standing with a curse of blue cheese sweat. When learning the arts, one must be able to imagine a delightfully runny Lurian and cider pairing, as well as a gassy agony of the lactose intolerant. Good. Uh-oh. I, I got spotted. What about... Do you have anything on you? Cheese. Okay. Ball. A stuffed bear. Gold. And a genie ring. The ring from this from the genie who worked in the circus. It's where I can cast Mage Hand. The subtle magical ability explain how the genie cheats the wheel! Taking his ball? With your hand in a pocket. Mm, embarrassing. And possibly dangerous. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Spin the wheel again. I mean, I don't know, man. It sounds like sunk cost fallacy to me, bro. Okay. All right. Akabi. You failed to win the grand prize, but fear not, grotesque one. Try again. Be victorious. I'd like to spin the wheel again, please. Yes! You will win the jackpot this time. I am sure of it. Oh, 
Let's fucking go! <laughs> How does it feel, sucker? <laughs> That's gonna be the dialogue. How does it feel, sucker? You dare enjoy the jackpot, muley cut. Uh oh. oh. <laughs> there are dinosaurs here, chat. Um. <laughs> I'm not very good at sneaking, nor solo survival. Um, okay, hang on, let me just pan the camera around a little bit. So we've got like, oh, it's, it's, ooh, it's like a nest! Now's the perfect time to get a better at solo combat, so true. Okay, we're gonna do a little, oh, it's a pile of bones here. Boner? That's a bottle? Big bit of wood. Oh gear. Dinosaurs everywhere! Oh, oh no. Run! Enjoy losing the honor run. It's fine. Everyone else is still alive. We're going to run over here. Uh, um, scrolls? Save me, scrolls! Wait, are these guys vulnerable to anything? Oh! Uz! Come here, Uz! Oh, they're lobotomized. Go Operation Meat Lots Shield. These days. <laughs> oh, us oh, is dying. Oh, these things are so. Far oh, there's another one. Sorry, Uz, you're gonna... In fact, no, hang on. Uz is on the same initiative order as Uz. So we're going to... Devour Intellect. We passed that save. That Time sucks. We're gonna use Wall of Fire. Burn, baby, burn! Disco Inferno! We 
We've so got this. Okay, so we're going to run us out of the fire. Mm -mm. No, we're not. We're not. They're going to die. Yeah, get that, sucker! Oh. Wait, where'd my wall of fire go? Oh, no. All the pouncing everywhere. Wait, my wall of fire's already gone. Are you kidding? Oh. You are in showing up now that you're all over. She's like, you poor little flesh puppet. I'm bad at dates. I thought it was tomorrow. Hello, hello. Hi, Foxy. I am streaming tomorrow as well. I'm doing um the uh what do you call it run? The speed run tomorrow? I think we might need to rely on strength here. I'm going to drink a hill giant potion. I'm just going to start bashing. <laughs> Mating pheromones? Mating Frenzy. He has an additional 5 damage and gains resistance against all damage types except psychic damage. Good! 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 Unironically good. Time for a mind blast, suckers! Yeah, baby! Yes, us. Transport to the Flintstones dimension. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Here we go again. God damn, Dirge hits like a runaway dump truck when he wants to. I love Jurassic Park. I love books. Uh, we're gonna... Warcast? Nice, a little bit of damage. Oh, Pouncy Wouncies. Where are you going? Come here. I'm not done killing you. Shocking grasp. Can't take reactions. Good. Good. What would you call this Dirge build? Himbo build. Oh, critical mess. You're gonna run away now that your mate's dead, you pussy! <laughs> so true. I want to kill you, please! Did it? Easy game? Easy game for babies? They didn't drop any loot? <laughs> I don't think... Oh, there's a dead dude here. Dead adventurer. Antidote and gold. Wait, can I speak with dead? Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Invalid target. Awesome. It's a skeleton here. I hope. Oh, what? Scroll of slow. Oh, that's very strong. Silver ingot, gold. Oh wow! Journey through the jungle. How you doing, Voxy? Having a having a good day? You uh, you just missed Dom. Dom was hanging out in chat for a while. Okay, I'm gonna do my best Attenborough Attenborough voice. The sun had just fallen below the horizon when I first heard its call. A thousand reed pipes at once 
whistling a single beautiful, terrible song. Aluthalong, along, said Jor. It is coming. Jor dropped her pack and scurried up the nearest bitter. With a bit more effort, I climbed a tree of my own, and the two of us surveyed the grassy ground beneath. Ah, There it is. There it was again. Above and beneath and all around. So close my skull vibrated with the sound. The ferns and foliage under me rippled and swayed. Jaw held a finger to her lips to demand my silence. And in one motion, it snatched her. A vine? A tentacle? It hardly matters. The hunter had found... It's prey. Jaws scream swelled and faded as Ulu Thalong dragged her away. I leapt down to give chase. But the creature left no mark behind. The grasses were untrampled, the shrubs unbroken. I had only the memory of that harrowing call to guide me. Dom is telling me about a weird console he found as we speak. Yeah, uh, we like I spoke to Dom earlier on a, on a call. He talked to me in great detail about this thing. I think um, there's going to be some fun stuff coming up in the future. It, it's, it's good fun. Oh, look at this! Can we climb? Can we climb up here? Yes, we can. Look at this! Check this shit out. I can't wait for Dom to reveal his latest poor financial purchase. The dude's brain is enormous. Absolute huge brain. The biggest brain. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. There's a platform over there. I'm just going to fly over there. Check that shit out. Getting a Mind Flayer tadpole was the best thing to ever happen to me. Don't mess with genies. I learned my lesson. Pa used to tell me I need to stop with the tricks, that I'd meet someone I couldn't fool, some, fool someday, that I'd have to pay more than a couple of drinks to be forgotten. When those miners kicked me out of Nashville with nothing but my shorts, I thought that was the worst it could get. It wasn't. Rock bottom isn't when forgiveness is hard game. It's when you're, you've laughed, threatened, begged and cried, and they all still wouldn't let it go. I shouldn't have taken that, ge that genie shinies. I shouldn't have tweaked his wheel. I shouldn't have rubbed it in his face. I learned my lesson, Pa, but too late. Someone says, lo and behold, another loopy. No! It's a weird Wii ripoff, except it came out before the Wii, right? And it only was old Neo. Oh, we're maybe talking about something different then. I'm calling Musty at 3 a.m. to gush about printer-based consoles. I did goof earlier on that. I was like, I mean, mate, if you thought Casio Loopy being a, you know, Casio being a company that makes watches and calculators, and you find out that they make a printer, wait until he finds about Canon, who make cameras, that they make printers. He's going to lose his fucking mind. Poor financial purchases. I wouldn't know. I only bought uh, $150 worth of dice right now. Wait, did you really start? Did you really just buy 150 bucks worth of, of, of dice? If so, you like share with class, please. I'd like to see these dice, please. Always hungry. Arrow fire. Band of the Mystic Scoundrel. Illusion quickening. After hitting a creature with a weapon attack, you can cast illusion or enchantment spells as a bonus action. Hmm. That's absolutely bananas. Holy smokes. Uh, it's always hungry, right? I hear them. Hunting. Hungry. Always hungry. I'm safe for now, but it's only a matter of time before they find me. Why did I argue with that stupid, loudmouthed genie? I thought he was a showboating idiot. I never thought he'd send me to Chult. I read stories about this place as a child. I thought it was a wondrous land teeming with exotic beasts. But it's a hellscape of venomous snakes, insects, and scaled monsters that hunt me day and night. I've kept them at bay with wits and magic, but I can't keep up. 
the monsters guard a portal. Where it leads, I don't know. But even if I find myself in the fires of a furnace, I will claw my way out, find that circus, and burn it to the ground. When is Dom going to get the Casio EP? Aw, sleepy boy. Are you going to set up the thing, Musty? The thing? I don't, I don't know what thing you referring to. I bought some dice for, uh, for my D and D group when I see them next week. That's super exciting! Wait, you're meeting your D and D group like in person? That's super rad. Buy me my DMs to not kill my characters. Incredible. Yeah, do I have any enchantment spells? That's enchantment. Tash Sidious Laughter is enchantment. Vicious Mockery's enchantment. That's actually very good. We're going to get rid of the Ring of Exalted Marrow. We're going to replace it with the Ring of the Mystic Scoundrel. That's actually Loki really good. Being able to cast Vicious Mockery as a can as a bonus action would be very, very useful. Maybe Bone caps. We're going to fly back down here. You know what we discussed in Discord? Don't want to say in case you change your mind. I'm really sorry. Would you mind DMing me on Discord? I'm I'm actually not sure what you're referring to in this point in time. I'm I'm really sorry. It's it's been a it's been a busy week. Let me just oh, let me just go sneaky peeky real quick. Uh, I'm gonna oh. Oh, right. I, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send him an eyes emoji. There we go. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Um. Yes. Thank, thank you, Arch. Yeah. So, I think I'm gonna make a Discord server. I'm not sure exactly when, but I think I'm gonna be doing it sooner rather than later. Some point over this weekend, I'm gonna set up a Discord server, uh, so that we can chat about. The games that have been on stream, hang out outside of stream, share memes, all that sort of stuff. Um, so we have a single point where we can just like hang out if we so wish, and kind of like future proofing things so that when yeah you know, you know, if we get some more folks, we can be like, oh hey, here's a place where we can go and hang out. Um, so that's going to be set up some point this weekend. Um, I imagine it's going to be somewhat similar to the Video Dojo Hub, but maybe a bit laxer on, um, like, more adult topics, I suppose. It's going to be a bit laxer on that. Um, but yeah, I, I'm gonna we're going to get that set up at some point this this weekend. Um, so if people would like to join that, I'll be popping a link in the description once this is all set up. Or if people want to drop me a DM on Discord, because I know a lot of you do you have me as friends on Discord? Feel free to do so, and we'll get something sorted out. It's like the Video Dojo Discord, but you can swear. So true. You can say the naughty fuck word. <laughs> Speaking of which, I'm going to blast this dinosaur. We open up combat. We're going well. We're going well. <laughs> I can talk to Musty and Arch and be able to talk about psychology, uh, physiology. Oh, sorry, philosophy. I beg your pardon. And sex. It's true. Call it a Dig Digio Bojo Hub. Make the icons the same as video. <laughs> Sure, and so don't you have, but with inverted colours. So true. Don will sue me. Don will sue me. Like, immediately. On my way. I'm gonna run away from this dinosaur. Oh, I shouldn't have run away from the dinosaur. What am I doing? That was really stupid of me. Okay, we're gonna go for ranged attacks. Excellent. Excellent. We're gonna need a flaming arrow.
fighting our way out of the evil. Oh, it's frightened. Why are you frightened, little guy? Is it because it's bludgeoning time? Oh, hang on. I can just fly over. Check this shit out. Whoosh. Oh, gosh. God damn, melee dirge is really strong. Melee dirge is super strong. You, you misshapen flesh lump. It's Kova Nomad. Hey man, welcome to the stream. How you doing, bro? Hope you're having an excellent day. I'm doing great, thank you, Koma Nomad. Really good, really good. Having a having a good a good good day so far. Yeah, really good. Just really inflicted that guy's psychic damage by calling him a sis. It's like Twitter. It's true. It's true. Melly Dirge is strong. Who would have thought that drinking a magic potion to give you the strength of a hill giant would be so good, huh? <laughs> it's a skeleton. With gold! Nourishing gold! My favourite... Portal over there. Okay, right, right, right. What's going on here? Ah, oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. Everyone's coming with me to make dindins. Nice. Delicious. Is there any more dinosaurs I can slap around? Yes, there is. And I'm feeling a lot more confident in my dinosaur slaying abilities. Oh, no, 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 hold still. So what's it? What is Vicious Massacre doing? Disband? Yeah, yeah, okay, good, 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 good. Why are they not attacking? I don't understand why he's not attacking. God damn, melee dirge is so strong. What the fuck? That's that's actually ridiculously good. Listen, I have a D and D question. Is it custom to wear spirit Halloween costumes when playing? Oh, customary to uh, wear Halloween costumes when playing D and D with friends. It's a requirement. It actually, says Arch. Uh, sorry, not Arch. Uh, it says Stars. To Arch. Um, I mean, I've dressed up for D and D, but I don't always do it. Uh. 
yeah, it's kind of kind of up to you. You know, I I think dressing up can be a really really fun way of getting into character. Personally, uh, I know not everyone feels that way, but yeah, I, you can dress up if you want to. Boxer says, "Dur showing off his oily muscles." He just like takes off his armor. He's ripped as fuck. Nice. Chest. Do I have a lockpick I can use? Open up. Ooh, DC twenty. That's not great. I don't have good odds of opening this. Oh. <laughs> Easy. Easy. I once went to a uh, D and D set. If I know, it wasn't a D and D session. It was a party with my D and D group. Uh, where we dressed up as uh, like mythological beings and gods and stuff. I went as Dionysus, the god of wine and revelry. Uh, it was really good. It was really good. Uh, a lot of fun. A lot of fun. What's in the chest? Nyrulna. Oh my god. Zephyr Connection. This weapon will return to your hand when thrown. You cannot be forced to drop the trident. When thrown, the weapon creates an explosion that deals 3d4 thunder damage in a 6 meter blast centered on the target. Veil of the Wind. You gain a plus 3 bonus to your movement speed and jump distance. Equipping this weapon gives you immunity to all damage. Narulna. Glowing. This weapon object, sorry, this object shines with glowing light in a radius of six meters. It's a plus three weapon chant. This is this bullshit, OP. <laughs> a Zephyr Flash. Rush forward, creating an air vortex that blasts flow foes and possibly inflicts bleeding. Zephyr Break. Emit a powerful gale of wind that clears all clouds and pushes creatures back five meters, possibly inflicting off balance. So this is very good. This is very, very good. God, it deals a lot of damage. Blood of Lathander is very, very strong as well, though. Someone says, depends on the individual, I hate wearing clothes I'm not used to. Yeah, no, you, you don't have to dress up if you don't want to. This is this is very, very strong. This is a very, very strong weapon. Um, I'm going to need to do some thinking, because I don't know whether Dirge should have this as a weapon, or I don't know whether Halson gets proficiency in Tridents or not. Let's go through this portal. See where it takes us. Oh, stinky. Oh no, we've come out of the shit dimension. Oh no. We've emerged from the shit dimension. Oh, we're incredibly stinky. We've got to go kick that dude's ass. Hey, look, everyone's here. Uh, hang on, Halson. Sylvanus' blessing upon you too, buddy. Um, what proficiencies do you have in weapons? Martial weapons. You cannot use tridents. Is a trident, right? Yes. Hmm. Can you use maces? You can use maces. Okay. We're going to give Blood of Lathander to Halson. We're going to equip the trident. Shouldn't wish to live in more interesting times. Does mean getting rid of the big stick.
coming and says, an atmosphere that isn't dark and gloomy in my dark urge game? So true. What other D&D &D and, &D and TV show tropes are required? You will need to make a miniature of your character at some point. Just, you'd never know when that's going to be. Look at these guys. Viola Silvertongue. Lucretius hire you. Stay out of my way, talentless half-wit. You know, if I wasn't a reformed murderer, you'd be getting dirged right now. Let's... Okay, hang on. We're gonna go talk to Akabi real quick. Like Mewling curd. Did the despicable cheetah enjoy his vacation? <laughs> I had a lot of fun, actually. Thanks. Akabi is delighted you enjoyed it, repugnant mortal. Be gone. Akabi is sick of you. I'm not done with you, buddy. Akabi is tired of the Wheel of Wonders. He is now closed. <laughs> That's very, very funny. That's very, very funny. So, hang on. This weapon will return to your hand when thrown. You cannot be forced to drop the shrine. When thrown, the weapon creates an explosion that deals 3d4 thunder damage in a 6 meter radius. Sent it on the target. That's very strong. That's very, very strong. Alright, let's continue exploring. Are we all enjoying our time at the circus? Did we enjoy our vacation, you m muling curds? Who's this guy? He's a kobold! Half of a kobold! He's got a little... He's got a hat! Oh, oh, hungry little hobgoblin. Want a treato? I have lots of treatos and magics and junks I find. Uh, don't worry, I only take junks from dead people. I is nice. <laughs> <laughs> How often do you loot corpses for treatos, Papa? Oh, lots of times. The beasts ate a kiddo the other day, and I got some good stuffs. <laughs> I, I, I mean, uh, circus is safe. Do not uh, worry. Yes. He's the best. Let me see what you have, bud. Oh, this guy's incredible! Look at him! Look at this little goober! Oh, he's incredibly good. What a good boy! Would you like to buy a hand? No? What about a boot? No? What about a silver bar? You would like that, okay. I'm gonna sell loads of shit to this guy. Uh, ball? Would you like a ball? How about a ring? Good, 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 good. Arrow of Dragon Slaying? Good. Arrow of Beast Slaying? Good. Arrow of Darkness? Good. Hmm. Hmm. Can we get him into our party? Just throw out house and replace him with this little guy. I mean, that would be a tough call. Gen genuinely, that would be a tough call. I love this little dude. Okay, we're going to buy this potion of speed. Uh... Oh god, you sell a lot of shit. 
Yogi claws. Dark displacement glove. Subtle swap. You gain a plus one attack bonus. A bonus to attack rolls when throwing. You may swap positions with the target if they fail a dexterity saving throw. That's pretty good. I did steal the genie's ball. I did steal. That is the genie's ball. He had it coming. He had it coming. Potion of gaseous form. It's me after I have beans. Ice wine. Yum, 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 yum. Elixir of viciousness. That's good. I thought that was a big potion. Though. It's not a big potion. Elixir of sea invisibility. Radiant resistance. I've never seen one of those before. Like, Arch, have you ever seen one of these before? I've never seen this. Like, ever. Maybe I shouldn't. Yeah, I'm gonna, ta I'm gonna take back the ball. We'll send it to camp. In fact, we're gonna send loads of this crap back. Yeah. Cold snap. Oh, we need to give this to um. Starian. I'm literally, I don't have any memory of seeing Radiance Potions. That's really cool. Elixir of Cloud Giant Strength. Increase a creature's strength to 27? Oh, Strength Dirge, though. Strength Dirge would be very, very good. I didn't realize how good it was. 27 strength. Elixir of Battle Mage's power. Drink to increase the effectiveness of your spells. Gain 3 Arcane Acuity. That's good. That's good. He can lift all of us little critters in chat with that. It's true. It's true. It's true. Oh. Mm, I'm buying it. I'm buying it. That's a good deal. I'm going to buy the Elixir of Viciousness as well while we're at it. Do we have any other tap we can sell? Maybe we do want to give that axe to somebody. I don't know. Okay, thank you very much, Popper. Oh, take this ring. I don't need it. Take this bell. I don't need it. <laughs> What's the ability modifier at 27? Um, plus 7? I think? No. Plus eight. Plus eight. It's very strong. Plus eight is ridiculously good. So that's plus eight to all melee attack rolls and to damage dealt by melee weapons. It's really strong. It's really, really strong. That'd be good for even like someone with maxed out strength. That's super good. It doesn't sell any regular potions though. That's a shame. Grilled miniature, grilled miniature, giant space hamster. No matter how small, rare, or cute a critter, it will still fill your stomach. I'm gonna buy one of those. I'm gonna buy one of those. Delicious. Bye bye now. Come back to Papa soon. Not that strong, I could take him off. <laughs> True. In in a fight, right, stars? It 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 in in a fight, right? R right? It in a fight? <laughs> so this is what happened to Mousy after Tom stopped playing GPG. True. Um all right, look at this. Delicious. 
fuck's going on over here? Look at this guy! Bony! Bony! Bony and stony! Is your camp drab? Dreary? Then you have come to the right place. Browse our bespoke stony and bony creations. Or commission a statue in your likeness. It is our most sought after service. Oh, a statue would be pretty good. Stony and bony, which are you? Bony, at your service. <laughs> My darling wife, Stony. Is she not magnificent? <laughs> she is magnificent, Bony. She's uh, a lot bigger than you. I know. It's wondrous. Now, <laughs> what can I do for you? <laughs> oh, I love this guy. He's great. Let's see what you have. Oh, you shall be thrilled and delighted. I know it. <laughs> Foxy and someone immediately recognize he's just like me for real. <laughs> oh, it sells basilisk oil. Turns a petrified creature back into organic form. Good, good, good. Good thing to have as a statue seller. Very good. Scroll of flesh to stone. Very nothing to read into there. Scroll of stone skin. Mm-hmm. Wall of stone. Good, 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 good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, he sell. He certainly sells rocks. He sells rocks. Okay. Nothing caught your eye. I shan't tell my wife. She'd be most upset. Another big appreciator. How much is it to get a statue made, bro? Ah, the adventurer returns. Care to purchase a bespoke stony and bony creation? I like a statue of myself, my camp. My wife shall be delighted. Customs are her favorite, particularly when their facial structure is as unique as yours. I don't have enough money. Uh, then feel free to browse our workshop, but be quiet. My wife is at her creative zenith, and I do not wish her to be disturbed. So I shouldn't go talk to her. Don't forget that Dragonborn's order. It's due shortly. I love this guy. They're a great couple. Goals? How much gold do we have, then? Not much. Hang on, let me let me go back to camp. I'm gonna see if I've got anything that I can, sh any shit I can sell. Hello, do we have any shit I can sell? Ah, Shadowheart. I'm gonna take your, I'm gonna take your armor. Uh, Gale, do you have anything? Okay, I'm gonna take all your shit. Thank you, Gale. Will, do you have anything? No. Lazelle, do you have anything? Mm, nothing that I want to sell. What about in here? Ooh, I've got some shit to sell. I'm gonna sell this. Oh, we're gonna sell this. Oh, we're gonna sell this. Uh, I'm gonna sell this. Oh, we're going to sell this Infernal Iron? Oh, I'm not going to sell this Infernal Iron, I guess. Uh... Oh, knives? Can I pick up? I, I don't want to use this. I want to add this to my wares. Oh, we've got a bunch of shit we can sell, actually. Yes! Strange chunk of amber with blood in it. Can I sell that? It's the blood of Lathander for realsies. We've got so much shit that we can sell, actually. Yes! Yes! Very good. 
Very good. We'll take the psionic ward armor as well. This is kind of crappy. Nice. Nice. Sell back his fault. I'm going to hold on to it. It's a, it's a trophy. Your tum tum wants a treat, don't it? Good, good. Papa's got you covered. Let me see what you have, Papa. Yes, I have lots of stuff just for you. This guy's great. Okay, um. Oh, shit. I. Right. Hang on. I just realized that it, it made me it equipped it equipped the shit. That's why it wasn't transferring when I was double clicking it. It was equipping the shit. Oh, hang on. Wondrous gloves. That's good. Boots of brilliance. That's good. Uh. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine. I want to make sure I'm not going to sell anything that I don't want to sell. Hopper! Your tum -tum wants a okay. Yes. Let me let me sell let me sell you this shit. Give me your shit! Insufficient gold! Insufficient gold! How dare you come here with insufficient gold! Okay, there we go. Bye bye now. Come back to Papa soon. I love this guy so much. Act 3 is full of amazing NPCs. It is. Oh, I was reading a thing earlier on, right? Um, uh, the adventure I was reading a thing that was talking about the development of Baldur's Gate 3. And how originally Catherick Thorne was meant to be a companion. That it was originally going to be the case that he was going to be recruitable. If you were able to talk him down, that you'd be able to actually have a redemption arc with him. Where he would return to Saluna. But it's one of those things that the developers, they, they were working on it right until quite late in development. And they were just like, we can't bring this to fruition. There's just so much shit left for us to do. Um, we need to get this game out. If we keep following this up, we're going to be on this for like hundreds of more hours worth of man hours. So they didn't continue it. So I'm really sad because having Catherick as a companion would have been amazing. It would have been amazing. We could have had a Catboy companion. Yeah, we could have had a Catboy companion. First you steal shots of religion from her, now you want to steal her shit. Yes! Nothing caught your eye. Hey, yo! <laughs> it says Boxy. Yeah, you Catboy Companion, man. Catboy Companion. Okay, we're gonna go sell the last of this shit to the mummy. YouTube is determined to make me watch this like five seconds behind. What do you mean? What do you mean? As in, like, is the audio desynced with what's on screen? Okay, I'm gonna sell the graceful cloth. Oh, we're not gonna sell the graceful cloth, actually. We're gonna buy some extra shit first. Hmm. Orange dye. Taking that. She doesn't have enough gold for me to buy stuff, so I'm gonna buy. As much of her dyes as possible. Muddy red dye, very good, very good. Pink and leaf green dye, very good, very good. Lavender dye, very pretty. I buy that. Sea green dye, very good. Black and jade green dye, gonna buy that. Then I'm gonna sell you the graceful cloth in return. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Someone says, no Catboy Companion, uh, but I'm right here. It's true, you are a Catboy Companion. Every time I watch it live, it lags. Nyah, I'll see myself out. No, you don't need to see yourself out. We encourage the nyah. 
Yeah. Um, okay. We... Okay, we've got a bunch of new die. That's really cool. Karlak? Karlak looks good right now. I don't want to dye her clothes. Uh, we can buy a statue now, right? Hang on, where's the statue guy? Yes! Yes, you! Bony, sell me a statue, please! Ah, I'd like a statue, please. I shall be delighted. Customs are her favorite, particularly when their facial structure is as unique as yours. <laughs> like a statue of me armed and ready for battle. How about a statue of me, but in my night clothes? Yeah, we want that. A statue of me in my night clothes. Tremendous. Stony darling. Let us put this towards our getaway in the Moonshay Isles. I'll have your statue shipped to your camp. You shall love it. We guarantee it. I cannot wait. First of any, Dark Edge is inspired. How do I get that? Hang on. First of many, 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 first of many? First of many? Request a statue of your mortal form. Nice. Fred. Fred's a red cap. Fred. Okay. Understandable. Have a, have a nice day. I'm a scummy ball bag. What's going on here? <gasps> Look at these skeletons! Boris, Lucille, and Jacob. Lucretius. Hello. Oh, I love her so much. Is this a circus act? We are decades from that. I hope they could open for dribbles. Not that my star needs the support, but at this rate, who knows? Call me Lucretius, ringmaster, necromancer, bringer of the night. Oh, and wine lover extraordinaire. Normally, I'd invite you into my tent for a lovely vintage, but these graceless skellies need my full attention. Enjoy my circus, darling. So you, you're the, the, the head honcho here. Was that a rat crawling on the ground? Yeah, look at these, look at these rats. Scratchy and itchy. It's itchy and scratchy. Ratty gang. Let's get a hashtag Ratty Gang in the chat. Ratty Gang? The crawling hand? <laughs> That's very good. That's very good. I feel like I've heard the name Lucretius before. Maybe you have. It's a pumpkin. This is Halloween themed? Halloween game? Spooky game? Look at this! High Wire Hilda! Do not stand too close! The flames have a life of their own! Flames when? Flames when? Wah! 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 
Wah! Right. What's going on here? Look at this! It's a displacer beast! Shadow Whiskers! The beast ignores you. Her eyes locked on the crowd. Make a noise trying to catch her attention. What's going on here then? Can I get some guidance, please? Easiest game! Easiest game I've ever played! Easiest game I've ever played! You know, Displacer Beast, the only other kitty I've seen got fucking shot with a crossbow! <laughs> You see a tidal wave of hate and violence in her eyes before she turns away. Poor creature, locked in a cage, denied her true nature. A civilization would call her a monstrosity, yet it treats her like this. She will attack and kill at the first opportunity. Understandable. Kill them all, Kitty! <laughs> Holy shit! Examine the cage? Oh, I'm not very smart. Oh. Oh, my brain is hollow. Let her. She's a good she's a good kitty. The bars look sturdy. Good. Sturdy as hack? I did Kill them all, kitty! Kill them all! Hmm. <laughs> Do I? One? One's in the chat? One's in the chat if I should? So I was very enthusiastically writing many ones. Okay. Kill them all, Kitty. Alison disapproves. <laughs> Karen. Ooh, don't get too close, or Crimson here might decide you look tasty. Crimson. Oh, Crimson's the dinosaur. Crimson. The creature is near rabid in his bloodlust. Easy, I'm not gonna hurt you. He growls a clear warning. Gonna examine the animal. Easiest game I've ever played. Colossal game for babies. Oh, you hungry boy? You want some meat? The mention of the word meat, his stance softens. Oh, this hungry guy! Eat this, buddy! He whimpers in gratitude and falls on the morsel instantly. Oh, this poor guy! Aww! Poor little dude! Oh, it's a circus clown! Check this guy out! Oh, so this music's so good! Oh, hang on, Carlax leveled up! Yeah, Halsa didn't approve of us doing that. Carlax? Time for me to level you up, girl. Big lady gets bigger? Oh. Intimidating presence. Menace an enemy and instill a terrible fear within them. While maintain you can use maintain intimidating presence to prolong the target's fear. That's very good. Oh, she's so big. I've got a long road ahead. Ryland. Don't get too close. Beasties are hungry. And you look like food. Next long rest, please, big potion, Halson. Shall do. 
Another step forward. Buddy the dog is my very best friend. Do you know why? Why? Because with him, anything is possible. Hey! <laughs> Good puns. <laughs> because clowns aren't enough of a horror already. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear about the scarecrow who lost a fight? <laughs> Bro, get off the stage! <laughs> it's very good. It's very good. Oh, that's worse than the usual pun in this community. It's true, right? Six feet apart, must it? Why six feet apart? I don't understand. Sure did! His opponent was really clutching at straws! Oh, hey! Looks like we've got a proper comedian in our midst. Good thing, too. I'll need someone with your wits for my next trick. Now, where are you? A bloodthirsty rush of fury engulfs you. You want to butcher the crowd, women and children alike, and soak in their innards. It is glorious. Oh. You, my special assistant. Come on up. Uh. Uh. Okay, I'm going to put this to a poll. I'm going to put this to a poll. Who are we going to have go up on stage? Who are we going to have go up on stage? We're going to start a poll. Who should go up on stage? Us! It's Durgeon time, baby! Astarian. Carlatch. Halsin Pole. I can't, I can't actually remember which one four is. Hang on. A star. <laughs> okay, sending a star up would be very, very funny. That's true. He would hate it. I bet he would. I bet he would. <laughs> oh, if it's going to be a split, I'm going to need to get my dice out. Hang on. I don't know how close it's going to be. It's a very close vote. Hang on. Foxy says, I think a siren would be great. The poll's rigged. If we pick us, you'd send up the intellect devourer. So true. So true. Brain time. Sar <laughs> says, you're all entitled to your wrong opinions. Okay, I'm going to close the poll. It's a split three ways, so I'm going to roll a dice for this. I think, for a rarity, I'm going to roll a d12, okay? I'm going to roll a great axe worth of damage. It's between Dirge, Astarian, and Halson. 1 through 4, Dirge. 5 through 8, Astarian. 9 through 12, Halson. Okay? Let me bring the mic nice and close to the dice. Here we go. That is a five. It's a starian. We're gonna set a starian up. It's a starian time. You love the spotlight, don't you, a starian? Here's your big chance, buddy. What? No. Don't you dare. This isn't funny. Oh, my heart. The enthusiasm. A sign to Oh, much. Now, up, up, double sharp. Oh, poor yeah, I'll You don't like him. Right there. Oh, perfect. Go on, Astarian. 
<laughs> of course. What fun. I'm going to fucking kill you. <laughs> Oh, he's the best character! He's so good! Now, you're very special. As special as can be! Does anyone know why? Why? You're special, my friend. Because I have a message just for you! Oh. Praise the absolute. Oh shit! Oh shit! Sorry, it's getting sinked by a dog! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, sorry, got hurt. He's been not prone. Yeah, we've got Bitey Buddy, the bark skin dog. Dribbles the Clown, Master of Puns and Punchlines. Oh no, and the Carnies! The Carnies are evil as well! The Clown makeup makes everything better, it's true. Okay, we're gonna frenzy. Oh, that was weird at being silent. Why was it silent? That was really strange. Alright, Carl, like, start killing? That's really strange. Why was it quiet? Huge damage? Huge damage! Oh, shit! He's just bonking a Starion! Oh. Doppelgangers! They're shapeshifters! <gasps> can't believe you did this. I didn't do shit! It's all you guys voting! I can't believe you do this to me! Set the kitty free. Asarian too. Uh, sorry, Asarian, no. But not in the way I want. I didn't remember this, but not in the way I want it. Right, gotcha. Okay, it's Asarian's turn. <laughs> okay, Asarian. Mind render. Grim irony. Whenever this weapon lands a critical, both the target and the attacker have to see a wisdom saving throw or be affected by fits of laughter. I did roll a dice, that is true. Okay, we're going to disengage. I'm gonna run over here. Is this guy weak to anything? He's not. I'm just gonna blast him. Wait, mind read. Oh, hang on, mind read it. Hang on. Oh, it's ranged attacks. That sucks, bro. This guy also has Mind Reader? Eh? Uh, oh no! Oh, this is bad. Oh, they freed the kitty themselves. Oh! Oh! Also, it turns out updating your computer makes it run faster. You think I would have learned working it <laughs> working, it's true. This is this bad. Okay, we're gonna get up here and just start fucking this dude up. Ow! Dickhead! I'm gonna call him a cut. We make better strangers. Nice. Okay, Halson. It's time for you to get angry, buddy. And by angry, I mean owlbear. 
Kill them! Kill them! Kill the dog! Yes! Check this dude out! We got a, a bugbear? He's on our side! That's really cool. Here, we're gonna go for a. Hmm. We're gonna stand here. We're gonna go for a big cleave. Oh, big damage. Huge damage. Okay, that's one. Fuck. Doppelgangers. We could have charmed the kitty over to our side when we told them to kill everyone. Who would have thought that when we told them to kill everyone that it would kill everyone? Can the animals help you? That's a good point. I don't know whether release... I, I, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that releasing a ravenous dinosaur also might not be a good call. Ah... Uh... Oh, I slapped his ass! On the way. Okay, we're gonna... Just start stabbing? Can we sneak attack him? Yes, we can! Yes, we can! Yes, we can! Oh, big stabs! Good job, Astarian! I'm proud of you! Oh, jeez, Louise! Dirge is hitting pretty hard at the moment. Why, and why smell now of placenta musks? Ugh. Boom. He's a doppelganger as well! <gasps> Naughty doppelgangers. Excellent. Fury shall not be checked. Nice. Fyoda. Oh, he's coming to help! Check this guy out. What a badass. One big hit from Karlak? Oh, Karlak. get range sneak attack? We cannot. Alright, Twink. Let's go. Let's do this. Just just start blasting, Mr. Just start blasting, okay? Yes! Alright. Beast cage key. Oh, look at these guys. They're disgusting. Oh, no, catch a break. They're disgusting. Can't believe you're making me choose between Halson and Kitty. It's true. I'm sorry. Fyodor, thank you for helping. You fight good. Doppelganger, not so good. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's cool. Patty. Those bastards down like it was nothing. It was amazing. I just really love killing. Quinton. Can't believe Dribbles did this. The Dribbles. I can believe he would. He's a stinky butt. I'm gonna loot him. I'm gonna loot him. Is Patty also in the Rattyverse? Good question. Face painting kit. Word from the Tribunal. Clown Hammer. Clown Hammer. It's a hammer for clowns. Word from the Tribunal. Boom. We see it in you. The thirst, the art, the passion, the trail of cold, bloody murder that you've left in your track needs only the finishing touches to grant you a place among his favorite. Careful H. 
but he, capital H, requires something truly magnificent. A circus has appeared, boasting a collection of misfits and ragtags, but more importantly, a stage. Now comes the performance of your lifetime. When the curtain falls, the tribunal will be watching. Sounds like a perfect weapon for for you, Musty. I can't believe you'd say this to me. What's up for discussion? Gloria? I thought you were part of the show at first, but that was real. It's very funny that Asarian said, I'm going to fucking kill you. That was very funny. I hope it didn't knock our relationship too much. Eh, it's not great. There is much to do. Have a lot on my oh, everyone's leveled up as well. And well, in it. Nay, 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 we don't want to level up into Bard. We want to level up into Sorcery. Meta magic, baby! Wait, do we not do we not get meta magic yet? Oh, we do. Good, 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 good. Okay, spells. What am I going to pick? Shield would be good. I'm going to take shield. We want twin spell. Hmm... Mm. An extended spell. Replace spell. Do I want to switch anything out? Chromatic orb or magic missile? Nope, they're both good. And I get a feat? Wait, why do I get a feat? Hang on. Why do I get a feat? Sorcerers don't normally get a, a what? Why am I getting a feat right now? Hang on. I wouldn't question I'd just take it. Yeah, that's fair. Uh I mean, that's really good. That's really good. I might need to consider respecking. Because if I'm going to be using a strength weapon, taking Tavern Brawler to use a throwing weapon would unironically be really good. You make an unarmed attack or use an improvised weapon or throw something, your strength modifiers apply twice to the damage and for attack rolls. That would make me deadly accurate with throwing this trident. Or I could just rely on strength potions. Loki, I'm really enjoying Melee Dirge. Melee Dirge is really good. Mm. We're going to take Tavern Brawler for now. Uh, I get to... Bump a stat as well? Eh? Um, I guess strength? I don't gain anything from calm, but I do gain carry capacity with strength. Yeah. Wild. Wild. How many feet do you have? Many, I'm a spider. Drood. It's Drood in time. Oh, we're going to take... Resistance? Oh, hang on, what do we get here? Dinosaur forms! Air Myrmidon, Earth Myrmidon, Fire Myrmidon. Oh, this is strong! We get elemental forms now. Oh, that's very cool. That's very, very cool. Forgive me, Father, for I have hal sinned. A siren gets feet as well.
I'm not going to say no. I'm not going to say no. Uh... When you make crossbow attacks within melee range, your attack rolls don't have disadvantage. Your pierce and fox which are awesome for escaping wounds for twice as long. Okay, that's fine. Do wieldy. You can use two weapon fighting even if your weapons aren't light. You have plus one to your armor class or wielding weapon each hand. You can't do wield heavy weapons. Hmm. That might not be terrible, because a siren's always still wielding. And having more freedom for what weapons he can equip would be really useful. But so would just getting a plus one to AC from dexterity. Mm. Yeah, we're just going to go for a dexterity bump. We can come back to this at a late point. Amazing. I mean, I'm not going to say no to this. This rocks. Holy shit. Um, well, what a nightmare. What a nightmare. We've had all sorts of badness happening. On my way. Oh my gosh. Look at all the dead guys. Come to this plane was a mistake. You don't say, Lucretius. Oh dear. Screaming children and oozing corpse, and it's not even my birthday. I thought the absolute wouldn't dare set foot in my circus. To use such a woeful dribbles impersonator, why it's downright rude. How do you know they're an impersonator? As much as I love a good murder, my customers don't. The real dribbles, charms animals and makes puns. Awful puns. Not this. Alas, I cannot afford to lose any more staff. Funerals are so very expensive. I need to move the circus. But I cannot leave just yet. Not without dribbles. He was a star. Customers of every color and creed simply adored him. I need him back, and I'll shower the person who finds him in love, adoration, and adequate compensation. What do you say? A uh, less talk payment, because I'm very expensive. Huh. I can respect that. And you're in luck, because I am old, darling. Ancient. I have seen stars explode and civilizations fall. Along the way, I happened across items of such power that would make you weep with awe. Find my dribbles. You won't be disappointed. I mean, dribbles, dribbles are probably dead. Even better! Corpses are wonderful employees. They aren't picky about things right. like... Right, necromancer. <laughs> or eating. <laughs> okay, I'll look for dribble. That's the spirit, darling. And remember, I look after those who make me happy. Mm -hmm. Good luck, and thanks ever so much. Duly noted. How does Astarian feel? Good question, let's talk to him. Astarian? Ah, oh, my favorite traveling companion. Aww, that's really sweet. Are you worried about Kazador finding out you're back? I won't lie. The thought hardly fills me with her glee. Even with my newfound advantages, he's still an incredibly powerful vampire. But he's arrogant, too. If he does hear I'm back, he'll try to take me and expose himself in the process. Then I'll be able to strike. Uh, how will you strike exactly? He won't be alone, you know. <laughs> Neither will I, darling. At least I 
hope you'll come along for the show. But regardless, the plan is simple. Find him, stop him from gaining almighty power, and then really enjoy killing him. I... Un unfathomably based. Unfathomably based. I looked up Lucretius and she's voiced by a drag queen. That rocks! Wh who, who voices? Who voices Lucretius? The voice is familiar and I can't pin it. I don't I don't know where it is. Like where Daniel Jacob right. They're on Drag Race UK, right, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, nice. That's really cool. Find Dribbles the Clown. Dribbles the Clown, Star of the Circus is missing. Ringmaster Lucretius asks us to find him. He's likely dead, but it doesn't seem to bother her. Right. Seems like a good moment to talk. This is terrible. The circus is supposed to be a safe place. First performance at least. God. Oh God, is the it's the kobold okay? Oh thank God. Hopper, you're fine. Oh, clown man is dead. Oh well. Want a treat <laughs> It's a little callous. Why? I die, you die, we all die. Big wolf. Have a treat -o. It'll make it better. I love this little dude yes, so much. I has lots of stuff just for you. Oh no, don't woof. <laughs> I love that dog so much. You have no idea how much that dog speaks to my soul, Boxy. <laughs> Such a good boy. Bye bye now. Come back to Papa soon. Junks and magics for sale. So Mostly blood stained. Oh. Oh. A severed hand with a ring on the finger. The ring was smelted with a grinning face on the band. Oh. Oh no, that's a. Oh, oh no. Astarian! Astarian, my dude! My guy! And severed hand, a severed hand. Gonna give that to Dirge, he'll like that. You are the very best at what you do. I promise. Imagine the infinite supply of treaties we get with this with this guy with us. So true. Bony. Oh dribbles. My wife is heartbroken. Those two would chat from dawn until dusk. Such friends they were, but I'm sure a sizable contribution from an adventurer such as yourself would cheer her up. I'm just giving you five grand, bro. I'm gonna talk to your wife. I'm gonna riz her up. I'm gonna riz her up. Understandable. Have a great day. I heard chatter shad. <laughs> so true. Akabi? Akabi is tired of the Wheel of Wonders. He is now closed. So, okay. We've had... Murder most foul happen. The clown. The clown has been taken. 
murdered and replaced by a a, a, a doppelganger being viewed by some sort of tribunal. Wonder what that could be. Wonder what that could be, chat. Oh, this guy's still playing music. Madrash. You look a little shell shocked. Worry not. It's nothing a little music can't fix. Oh, I like you. What about you, Glingo? Please. Uh, uh, enjoy the circus. Which will never be the same without dribbles. It's true. Hang on. Asari, give me your violin, please. Asari, give me your violin. You don't need to be precious about it. Just give me a violin. I want to play music for this guy. Equip our spider layer, and we're gonna continue on our way. Uh, we should switch out some party members at this point. I think we're gonna head back to camp, and we're gonna get Lazel again. I mostly just want to car look around for the um, what do you call it? The uh, dryad. We're gonna get Lazel back. Oh, Lazel. Boulder's gate at last. We should find Charesse's caress. Voss will be waiting. He will. That's true. I'd like you to join me. You're full up. Dismiss someone first. Take Carlax's place. Good. Our victory is most certain. She's so cool. Lazel, time for you to level up. Subclass features. Improved combat superiority. That's really good. We get two more maneuvers. Or the passive. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, very good. The Dragonborn guy is good, though. Yeah, it really is. Everyone and their mother is a doppelganger or Auron or something. Yeah, I love how skeevy this part of the game is. You never know who you can trust. Uh, we're gonna take Hmm Venting attack kind of sucks, that's not very good Maneuvering attack Spend a superiority die to make an attack that deals an additional 1d10 damage on a hit. Select which friendly creature will gain half its movement speed. Will not provoke attacks of opportunity. That could be quite useful. Might take that, actually. That's situational, but useful. Oh, pushing attack. That would be useful. It's free up a space. Yeah. Okay. That'll do. Oh, in fact... Other than that, maybe... Hmm. Maybe Rally would be more useful. It's only eight temporary hit points. So no, Maneuvering Attack's more useful. Maneuvering Attack's more useful. Good thing this is a lot more Dragon Ball and Scale Friends. Yeah. All right. what Scale Friends! Okay, let's leave. Oh, people are into the Dragonborn guy sexually. I disagree, but have fun. Yeah, fair. Path with corpses. I like him. He's a cool guy. With bones. Okay, we're going to take a short rest. Let's go hurt someone. 
And while we're taking the short rest in game, we're going to take a drink break because it's 2 a.m. or nearly 2 a.m. So I'm going to throw up the drink break screen and I'm going to go get a drink drink because my cup is empty. I could do with a nourishing refreshment. I would encourage you all to also go get yourself something to drink. Get yourself a glass of water or a soda or something else, something refreshing and tasty. Get yourself a snack, a healthy snack, ideally, like an apple or a peach or a pomegranate. And I'll be right back. I'll be like, uh, like three minutes. Okay. I'm going to pop on some music and I'll be right back. See you shortly, folks.
Hello there, everybody. I am back. We've returned from the land beyond the sea. Um, I've got myself a fresh drink, and I had a quick snack while I was up. Had uh, some cold pizza. It was good. Um, it was like a spicy, like a, a, a I don't know what it's called. Uh, in, yeah, I, I don't know how it's pronounced. Uh, let me let me look it up real quick. Hang on. Induja, Induja. I don't know how it's pronounced. Induja is a spicy, spreadable pork sausage from the region of Calabria, southern Italy. It's it's really good. It's like a, a like a spicy, spicy sausage. Super good. Um, so I had had some of that on pizza with um like little spicy pearl peppers. It was really good. Like super super good. Oh heck, Chups is here. Chups is here. Hey man, let's see what he said. Hopping in real quick to say that you're all wonderful and lovely. Okay, bye. Oh Chups, you're lovely. We love you all big we, we love you so much, man. You're such a cool guy. We love Chups. Yeah, he missed literal cheese magic. I can't believe he's done this. Um, let's let's continue. Let's continue playing Baldur's Gate. Let's continue playing Baldur's Gate. Chief says I'm gonna throw up. Uh, sorry, not Chief. Someone says I'm gonna throw up. Are you, are you okay? You okay there, buddy? It's. You like you doing good? Like uh, I hope you feel hope you feel better soon. I'm sorry you're not feeling well, man. Right, let's continue. Let me get my phone back on so I can have a look at chat as we continue. I put I'm gonna throw up in quotations. I don't understand. He said, I'm going to throw up the drink. Oh, right. 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 Okay. I understand. I understand. Right, 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 right. I'm following you. I'm following you. Let's have a look around. Heroic portrait of Gortash. Lord Enver Gortash, the people's man, the gate's protector. What a turd. What a turd. going on down here then, eh? What's up here? Angle Iron Smithy. Jildro Angel, uh, Angle Iron the Smith. If you're a customer, go down to the shop. Otherwise, clear off. What do you, t what do you sell? Well, Given this is in fact a blacksmith's, we sell things that need smithing. The shopkeeper can tell you more. Give the lazy sod something to do for once. The lazy sod? Oh, I don't know. They don't sound good. They don't sound good. Where's, where's the shop? What do you mean, where's. Go down to shop? Huh? Where? What? Is it in here? Vandalism is the only option. It's true. Well, this is a bedroom. With a trapped hatch, which we're not going to go down there. Blackboard. If you see this sign, that means you are too close to Gildro Angleiron. His work must not be interrupted. Oh, whoops, sorry. Is it through here? Whoa, look, swords. Maces and long swords. Whoa! 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 Paintings. You're gonna head downstairs? Hi, welcome to the Rivington General. Browse carefully, the weapons are sharp. 
Okay. I just need to say, this is my favorite NPC in the game. <laughs> okay, this person is my favorite NPC. It's not even close. Okay. So I won't hear anyone say anything bad about my wife, okay? She's wonderful. She's wonderful. Let's talk to her. X for Gap? Hi. Hi. Or want a blade? Or a bow? Or a dagger? Or maybe a spear is more your thing? You look like you know how to use a spear. By spear. What'd you say? Oh, I love you so much! You're so good! You're so good! <laughs> oh, I love that there's like seven eyes! Like seven eyes and like, hi! <laughs> oh, you're so good! Are you the one that sells the Swiss weapons? Grumpy fella, isn't he? On the outside, but he's a softy at heart, like molten steel. Also, he's a living legend. Do you know he's won Best Smith in Rivington seven years in a row? And, and he says that if I move enough stock, I might even get to have a go on the anvil. Why is she your favourite, Musty? Because she re like Voxy said, she really said hi with a three face after it. She's the best. Because she's Karlik, but she's Dragonborn. She's like Karlik if she was somehow more high energy. I love her. She's great. Uh, we'll tell you what. Let's see if I can help boost your sail figure. Show me what you got. Oh, yay! Oh, you're the... You're the fucking... Oh, you're the best character. Ah, oh, so good. So good! Okay, let's see what you're selling. Bone Spike Garb. Slab Jaw Determination. Gain 15 temporary hit points whenever you rage. Very good. Reduce all incoming damage by 2... When the wearer is struck by melee, the attacker takes three piercing damage. Oh, she's such a good character. She's so good. What an incredible character. Hey, Comet! Great to see you, man! How you been keeping? Super good to see you. Alas for us, low energy bottom stuff. Look, I'm just saying, I mean... Energy levels are good in all directions. I'm just, I'm just saying. 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 I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I am an appreciator of all energy levels. I want that garb. I want that armor so bad. I don't think I have the money for it. I want that for Karlak. Again, can we replace Halsin with her? No. No, we can't. He's on a contract. Well, Elven Chain. Rare medium armor. You're considered proficient with this armor while you're wearing it. The world gains plus two initiative bonus to their... Plus two to their initiative and advantage on dexterity saving throws. That's really strong. That's very good, actually. That would be really good um, for Gale. Actually, that would be really good for Gale. Oh, this music's good. Half plate. Ah. Uh. Stalker glove. Southern Court unawares. To plus one to initiative. Skullduggery out. Your sneak attack deals an additional 1d4 force damage. That sucks. That's, that's not very good. Swire's sled board. 
Shield Conduit. Shield Shrouds were in Force Conduit at the start of turn in combat. Ah! That's quite good. That's quite good. Hmm. Mostly just want the Bone Spike Garb, though. That would be really good for um, Karlak. The Dancing Breeze. Plus to Glaive. That's good. She did ask if I wanted to buy a spear. Go on, buy a spear. Why don't you? Hmm. Daggers, Battle Axes, Ambusher. Combat, you deal an additional 1d6 necrotic damage against creatures that haven't taken a turn yet. It's not terrible. It's actually really not terrible. Hang on, let me look at Asaurian's weapons. That might actually be better than Sword of Life Stealing. Not sure. I'll keep that in mind. Because a lot of these weapons, you don't actually have to actively be using them to gain their passive effects. So it's like, Asarian has this dagger here, the Knife of the Undermountain King. Um, this organ rearranging her ability actually doesn't need to be a primary... It doesn't need to be equipped in order to gain that benefit. Um, so that means that him using his crossbows, it makes him more likely to crit with them, even when he's not using them. Hmm. Okay. And that's a good selection here. I'm going to come back to you. I'm going to come back. I love you so much. Stars says they can rearrange my house. God fucking damn it. I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. It, it was just, it was inevitable, I suppose. But, jeez Louise. <laughs> What's going on out here? You said it, your worst. Saws? Cormac? Can I help you? Oh, bloody ribs. Sorry, mate. Had a run in with a mugger. If you need something, ask the missus. Are you alright, bud? Oh, poor guy. He had his ribs broken. Don't wander around Rivington alone, alright? My husband did and got mugged and beaten for his trouble. Shit, man. That's kind of scary. Circus poster. The circus of the last days has returned. See Dryad's gin. Oh. The clown. Oh well. He's coming. Down here. Hey. Uh. Murdered refuge. Uh. Uh. Oh, it's stinky down here. Oh, it's incredibly stinky! Let's loot them at least. Oh, let's loot them, ha huh? Come on, everyone. Oh, Allison's so big. Sarian? You okay there, buddy? You want to try jumping over? Starion? Really? Really? Starion? Oh, His leggy is too small. We'll be right back, okay, Starion? Just sit tight, okay? No traps. Murdered refugees? Last warning. You're sticking your immigrate your immigrator nose in where it doesn't belong. 
You got a brain in your head, you'll stay in your filthy camp with other absolute vagrant scum. Your girl didn't get the memo, you really don't want to know what happened to her. Now scrap that's so fucked up. You give this Warhammer to they sell. Oh, horse ranch. Um, okay, I'm gonna try to speak to these guys. The corpse has nothing to say. Oh. How disappointing. I want to know who murdered them so I could exact justice upon them! Is there really nothing down here? It's just like a bunch of murdered refugees? A wall? I see a uh, mushroom over there. I'm gonna go pick that. Yoink. Come on, folks. Let's get back out of here. Area under investigation. Flaming fist investigation underway. Stay back. It's the Mediterranean. It is Mediterranean. Is that nothing but scraps for days? Me here. The priests will open the temple up again. You will see. They're good people. Holy people. What's happening? Can I please have some food? Oh, sorry. I thought you were a priest. Oh. If you're looking for El Martyr's charity, you're out of luck. They've turned their backs on us, like everyone else. What have they Hang on. What's going on here, eh? Oh, hang on. Yeah, yeah, hang on. The necklace. The necklace. Hang on. We reached the open-handed temple. We should look for the spirit's granddaughter, Shira Clarwin. We found the amulet. It was possessed by spirit. The spirit wishes to be returned to his granddaughter. She lives in the open hand temple in Worms Crossing. Right, 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 right. Okay, right. So this is where the, you know, the sentient amulet needs to go. It needs to go here. Temple worship suspended until further notice. The faithful endure. Novice Bramble, what's going on here? The crying one weeps today. Our father Logan is dead. Murdered. <gasps> Murdered? What happened? I... I don't want to talk. My heart is in mourning. There's a lot of murder in this game. What's going on? What's going on? We let more outsiders in and more Baldurians die. Duke Stelney, Father Lorcan, it's no coincidence. We have faith here, Bill. Faith in people, no matter where they're from. Who had more faith than Father Lorcan? How did that work out? <laughs> oh! Is there any victim more fitting than one who forgives his own murderer? That's horrid! What a horrible thing to say to someone! Walking up to some guy who's like, you know what? We need to be open with people and going, You know what? I heard that the guy who was murdered was very forgiven. <laughs> Awful. I heard your priest died. My condolences. Thank you, stranger. Father Lorgan's Passing has saddened us all. Passing? He was murdered by one of the fugitives he was harboring. Bill, I beg you, be quiet. Even sinners receive Ilmater's grace, and Father Lorgan knew that. We don't pick and choose who we aid. If Father Lorgan had been picky, he might still be alive. Holy shit. Holy shit. It sounds like your guard would have been proud of Father Logan then. 
Thank you, stranger. A star in some solace knowing that he died in Ilmater's service. Does Ilmater's service involve protecting heretic absolutists? Or perhaps I missed that sermon. Enough, Bill. You seem a kind soul. Our temple is open to you. Walk well. <laughs> Star says the one answer would have been good though. Pick them, you coward. Yeah, maybe I should. Oh, pool. Look at this guy. Valeria, sleuth of helm. Holyphant. Oh, Holyphant. What's going on up here then, eh? Enough, I am a good dirty boy. What's going on here, eh? Look, investigator. Rilgor might have been a criminal, but he was no murderer. You're missing something. You have to be. Enough, Yanis. Listen to yourself. You are defending a man who ritually slaughtered your high priest. The evidence speaks for itself. Brilgore killed Father Lorgan, then, be it out of shame or profane duty, offed himself with the same blade. Case closed, Sister Yanis. Shitey little elephant. <laughs> oh, um... I apologize, stranger. Language like that hardly befits a rector of ill mater. Uh, it sounds like you were having quite a disagreement there. You could certainly say that. Two people just died on temple grounds. Our high priest, Father Logan, and one of the new refugees, Brilgor. Investigator Valeria thinks it's a murder and is content to blame Brilgor, the politically convenient target. Hmm. Why was Brilgor so politically convenient? Brilgor was a refugee. No one sticks up for them at the best of times, and with Gortash in power... Well, I expect the flaming fists will ban refugee aid now one of them's blamed for murder. Hmm. No murder story I've ever read has ended so simply. There must be more afoot! Feel free to look around the temple. But fair warning, the investigator won't change her mind without significant new evidence. Where can I find the investigator? Charessa's caress would be my best bet. That's her usual haunt after closing a case. Any idea what I should be looking for? Valeria never found the murder weapon, so that could be a start. Anything disproving the refugee murder suicide angle, really. Can you tell me where I can find Shira Clawman? I can tell you where to find her, but she won't be very chatty, I'm afraid. Why not? Shira passed away last year. Peacefully, mind. We buried her in the crypt under the temple, if you wish to visit. Oh, shit! But the granddaughter of the spirit sucking the amulet died last year. Best get going then. I really hope you find something. For all our sakes. All's Gear 3 Texas Edition. Oh. Oh. It'd be funny if it wasn't true. What's through here? Kitchen. Visitors kindly keep to common areas. Food will be served at meal times. Does someone say mystery game? Heck <laughs> yeah, I love mysteries. Brother Donick. I've said all I have to say already. Now I just want to pack up my kitchen and leave. I'm investigating Logan's murder. What do you know? I know it's not fair. This was the best job I ever had. Logan was kinder than most. And now they're blaming a refugee for his death. Typical. So you don't think Brogor killed him? No. 
Admiral Gore was a nice bloke. He came a couple of times for soup. Potato chowder was his favorite. Oh. Seen the murderous type? I love potato what chowder. I trust him. If a guy likes potato chowder, I trust him. <laughs> Someone writing mystery game, mystery game, mystery game, mystery game, mystery game. <laughs> Very excited, boy. Just like vibrating with excitement in the chat. <laughs> Uh, where are the bodies? We toss Brilgore out back. Sister Rose has Lorgan in the infirmary, preparing him for a decent burial. You could pop your head in and pay your respects. Okay. Mustard, da, da, da. what? 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 Ronda Santa's slight potato chowder, would you trust him? The trick question. That's a trick question. <laughs> um, potato chowder doesn't immediately make one a good person. He can just be indicative of being potentially good. Because potato chowder is very good. Oh, spoiled treacle tart, my favourite! I haven't had treacle tart in like a million years. This. Rights for passing. Bookerville Mastery Death Rights. Eh? Oh, a star in. Okay, sorry. Oh, I'm going to investigate that in a second. Book of Ilmartry Death Rites. This page is on turning... The book on the turning is particularly dog-eared. There will come a time, O oh, worshipful tormented, that you will have to comfort a faithless unfortunate as they pass from this life to the next. Or perhaps even more distastefully, you may be faced with the dying acolyte of a wretched god keen to shirk the blasted apple eye for waiting them. The Lord of the Wreck grants us many powers, but altering the moral velocity of a soul is one that we cannot shift on the deathbed. If one has lived a life of sin, their soul is bound for a simple place, no matter of their final uh, protestations. However, it would do much more harm than good to tell them this. Almater does not forbid the speaking of untruth, no matter how polite society deems the act. If you could spare the dying wretch some suffering as they pass, tell them that the weeping god awaits them with his balming embrace. Make them believe. Whatever torments the soul bears in the realms beyond, it remembers not their body, so spare them at least this final passing moment from hardship. That's kind of sweet. It's kind of sweet. Star says, Potato Chowder, this is Clam Town, buddy. This is Clam Town. <laughs> Welcome to Boston. <laughs> You're in Clam, You're in clam country here, buddy. Oh, buttons. Traded all our clam chowder for clam chowder. So true. Mm -mm. Uh oh. Okay. We're maybe going to go through there shortly, okay? A crypt. This must be where Shira. Here lies Flintster Sunseeker, born 1400 DR, died 1456 DR. Here lies Satida Atana, born 1411 DR, died 1485 DR. 
Star says I can't give Boston much credit, but I'll give it to them with clam chowder. Clam chowder's good. I like clam chowder. Here lies Reloric Windbane, born 1399 DR, died 1486 DR. At least Boston has the accent. Boston does have an accent. Here lies Sister Shira Clark, <laughs> date of birth unknown, died 1491 DR. So the years. Is. The okay. tomb of the amulet spirit's granddaughter. Time for a family reunion. Let's do this. <laughs> Darling Shira, faithful to the crying god. Long didst I wait, only to find thine empty flesh. Gone. Thou might be, alas. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, 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 oh. Honored Shira, her spirit has oh. died, and her body but merely a husk. <laughs> Swear I did to shed this foul mania and bestow it upon Shira. She was to endure, to suffer, as was her god Ilmata's want. Who now shall bear the madness Shah has wrought on me so I might no longer suffer? Oh, <laughs> shall it be thou? Oh, Jesus Christ. Park my car in half it yet. <laughs> I'm going to make an arcana check. Ponder what you know of the monk's affliction. What are the consequences of accepting it? Oh, it sucks. Our brain is so smooth. Doesn't matter, though. My brain's swollen and gorged with flavor. The monk himself holds your answer. Tasha's hideous laughter is a powerful skill, but earning it may come at the cost of wisdom. Wisdom? Okay, I'm gonna put this to a vote. I'm gonna put this to a vote. I'm gonna put this to a vote. Do we take the laughing curse? Yes. Yes. Ha 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 ha. Yes. No. Stop hole. Boss says wisdom is what you need to fight the dirge. That's true. That's true. It would give us access to be able to cast Tasha's hideous laughter, which is a very, very good spell. It's a very, very good spell. It could be useful. If it's a split pole, I'll roll a dice for it. <laughs> oh, no! It's a split pole again! Okay, where are my dice? Hang on. Hey, where are my glasses? Eh? I had my glasses not that long ago. Where did I put my glasses? Oh, they're over there. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Now we can all blame Musty if Carlet gets killed. Lo no! No, he can't! Oh, that would be so mean! Okay, we're going to roll a... Why haven't I rolled? I haven't rolled a D100 on stream. I'm going to roll a D100. Okay. I'm going to roll a d100. Hear that? That's a d100. Um, I'm going to end the poll. And for now, I'm going to give it 20 more seconds. 20 more seconds to wrap up your votes. Wrapping up those votes. I'm going to give it 15 more seconds. To wrap it up. Or the dice are coming out. I've got my 
got my D100. Got my D100. Gonna give it five more seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, it's going to the dice. I'm gonna roll a D100. If it is an odd number, we say no. If it's an even number, we say yes. Okay? I'm gonna roll a D100 now, okay? Let's get, let's get the mic nice and close. 34. So we do accept the curse. We take the curse upon ourselves. I'm gonna put the dice back. Okay. Let's just bear this curse. If it will bring you peace, then I will bear this madness. Your muscles tingle and your mouth twitches as the laughing madness spreads through you. The madness tugs at your mind, prods in places best left untouched. You feel your wisdom begin to drain. Oh, we can get the parasite to absorb the damage. Hmm. I'm going to call upon my parasite to absorb the strike. Easy. Easiest roll I've ever made. DC2, easy peasy. You remain wise as ever, even as Shah's madness spreads outward. You giggle, struck by the absurdity of the moment. A spirit hiding inside an amulet has brought you to the body of his granddaughter and possessed it. Outrageous. Ridiculous. Once again, you feel your wisdom draining away. Hilarious. What is it? Uh-oh. Oh, shit! Uh-oh. Oh, no! Okay. Uh, uh, I'm gonna hold firm. I will make uh, you will make this curse a gift. You will not surrender your wisdom. I am tough. I can take this. Yes. The urge to laugh dwindles. And you can't help but chuckle. You withstood the monk's madness and earned Tasha's hideous laughter. Easiest fucking game for babies. Oh, easy. First try. Friend, forgive me, for this mind was not mine own. May laughter be thy gift, never thy curse, the morning lord calls. Canst thou feel the warmth of his blessing? This is not my final twilight, but a new dawn. Farewell. Farewell. The corpse is an empty husk once more. The monk, liberated from madness, is finally at peace. Nice! He's gone. Well, he was always good for a laugh. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna throw her... Can I... Can I throw you back in the in the pit? Get back in there. I said get back in there. It's good enough. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. That'll, that'll do. That'll do. Easy. First try every time. Oh, look at this. Look at all this shit. Holy water. Scroll of Dominate Person. Scroll of Arcane Lark. Would be Saint. 
The book tells the story of a patriarchal woman who gave up her fortune to become a cleric of ill major in service in the outer city, and now seeks to be canonized after her death. Herein is the full is the full of true account of my bid to be canonized after my death as Saint Bridget of Elmater, the Broken God. He of compassion and mercy, the one who endures. I lived a blessed life of every privilege a patriarch woman can fathom. My parents were loving and generous, my community warm, our larder was always full to bursting. But in the years after the deaths of Saravark, my eyes were opened to the world as if it is, sorry, as it is, a world of pain and danger, a world where evil, if left unchecked, can thrive. I realized that my blessings had a cost. Why had I so much where others had so little? I could no longer remain in the Gilded Elysium of the Upper City, so I thought, so I sought to see the world as it truly was. Hmm. After the death of Saravok. Okay. Saravok. Careful, I bind. Saravok, Saravok, Saravok. Let's open this up. Let's crack this bad boy open. Easiest game I've ever played. Easiest game for babies. Easy game for babies. How for a skeleton key. Crack this one open, buddy. Oh. Oh, is it enough? It's not enough. A Starian. Give that another go, buddy. Give that another go. Easy. Easy, I say. It looks so garful movement. Your movement speed can't be reduced. Uh, okay, that's fine. That's fine. All's well that ends. No. Oh. Not as bad as it could have. Miracles of the Outer City. A record of alleged miraculous phenomena in the outskirts of the of Baldur's Gate attributed to Il Mater, customer of uh, Gildro Anglion, reckons he healed up mighty quick for a faithful forge burn. As if Il Mater had. Something to do with that irksome, talkative gent out of Carmen's powerful agent of suffering. Soup still showing up at refugees' camp even after the temple closed kitchen. Curious. Man's hands tied together in horses' reins claims he's a holy symbol. Man at Nestor reports feeling close to his duty since relocation to the refugee camp. That's nice. Oh, and that's just the, the dwarf guy that we met. That's really cool. It's cool that he's like, yeah, this this feels like uh, I've reinvigorated my duty. Holy shit, these are some good spells. Scroll of Dominate Person. Kinky. Scroll of Chain Lightning. Oh, that's a good spell. Oh, that's a good spell. That's a good, good spell. Scroll of Blight. Good. Good spells. Good spells to find down here. Holy shit. Pile of books on the floor? Anything good there? No? That's alright. Wow, found some good shit there. Let's go through here. Ugh. Ugh, fuck. Is this blood? What's this? Why? Oh, this is... Oh, that's blood. Oh. 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 Why does Dolor get all the fun as goodness? You are a weapon, my sweet. A sharper one than Dolor. He spends too much time with his prey. Dolor is an artist. You do well to think on that. These guys are bad guys. They've got the villain voice. What's going on down here, then, eh? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. We're getting bamboozled. 
mind readers. These guys are what do you call them? Uh, Time to move. Uh, so shit. What are they called? The things, the the the, the shapeshifters. I'm gonna blast them with a scorching ray. Missing like every shot. Brilliant. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Blast the Mastarian. Oh, oh. oh god, here they come! Stay there, buddy. Stay there. Oh, we grabbed a pike. Okay, let's try throwing this weapon. See what it does, huh? Hope this ends well. Oh, that's good damage. And it just does flat damage to people. Holy shit, that's absurd. That is absurdly good. Okay, we're gonna give inspiration to Astarian. Kill them, Lazel. Kill them, Lazel. Lazel deals so much damage, it's not even funny how strong she is. Sylvanas, guide my blows. There shall be no mercy. Game. There we go. I'm just going to blast this dude. Tormented. Nice! Easiest game I've ever played? Flowery Key. This key is splashed with blood. It's inscribed with the address of Frago's Flop House in Worms Crossing. Frago's Flop House. Full of mucus. Oh, the paralysis poison. Okay. Field reporter, Deathstalker Zoom. Aspirant Dolor is talented. If a touch careless, the dagger he discards lurks within these caves somewhere. Though I know not where, I can smell it. The fear musk from his kill stands in the air after the act because he lets them marinate first. They stand, they stand, lie, sit, stock still, as the poison fills their limbs with lead, knowing only two perfect facts. They are going to die. There is nothing they can do about it. That's so fucked up. What's inside? Rude. Drawing thunder arrows, okay. We can talk to this guy. Do you have anything to say, buddy? The corpse regards you, lifeless. I love that these dudes look like Kane from Legacy of Kane. You know what I mean? Like this sort of like vampire look from Legacy of Kane. Did you kill Father Logan? No. Interesting. Who's Dolor? Our blood red dwarf. Tricky. Hungry. Where is Dolor now? The corpse remains silent. It does not know. Is Dolor one of you? Yeah. Once more. 
What does Solo want? Transcendence. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. What does that mean? So they've been like killing a bunch of it. There's like so many dead people Someone down here. Arranging these corpses. What for? Clown severed torso. A colorful torso, torn and butchered. Hello, dribbles. Oh, his body's gonna be scattered all over the place, huh? Illicera the First. The effigy of Illicera, who watched and waited. What use her eyes? She thought herself a huntress, but couldn't fathom her wool. Below is an exaggerated signature written in blood. Orin the Red. We found a cruel and deliberately staged murder scene in Boulder's Gate. Could be the work of Orin. Orin did this! On her own? This is fucked up! What the shit? That might be worth a look. Hole? Stillmaker. Oh, it, it's a. It's a dagger that has whole person as a spell on it. That's really powerful. The dagger's twisting blade is designed to nick the flesh as many times as possible, allowing its paralytic poison to flow effortlessly into an, any unfortunate target. So messed up. We we'll give that to a Sarian. In fact, I'm gonna take it first. Must be where Father Logan was slaughtered. Right. Stillmaker. Interesting design. Very interesting design. I'm gonna give this to a Sarian for now. Along with Chill Snap. Well, this had to be offhand only. Yeah. Hmm. That's a good thing to have as backup. That's a useful, useful thing to have. I have such a headache. Someone says, "Well, the answers to everything are down here." <laughs> it's true. True. Oathbreaker in my boots. Swift as my feet can carry me. Oh, someone's got a really messed up looking hand. What's down there? Can we get down there? We can get down there. There's a cranky rock there. Okay, we're going to go down there in a second. We're just going to explore up here first. Why is there so much stuff down here? Delicious wine. Sponge tray. Using this will clear dirt, blood, face paint, and will remove conditions that make you smell. That's really useful. I'm taking that. And keep ourselves clean. Pile of sacks. Also got some sandals in it. Ah, interesting. Oh, there's a chest over there. Viridian crystal. Orange die. There's a lot to find down here. 
I don't think I've ever been here, I don't think. I don't remember this. Oh, fuck me! What is this? Looks like these people were trying to hide in the tunnels here. All the tieflings. But maybe they should have picked a better spot. Wow! Stop! <laughs> Such an asshole. Bracket. Dear Mrs. Priest. This letter, this letter is written in careful but erratic hand of a newly learned writer. Mum says I need to say thank you more, so thank you. Thank you for telling off that nasty woman who was shouting all those nasty things at me. That's three times I've wrote thank you now. Four! So I think my mum will be happy. One more thing. Did you see my teddy anywhere? I think I dropped it during all the shouting. Oh. Oh no. Oh man. Gotta steal your rings, buddy. Scroll of Sig. Dom's been here! Dom's been here! No, uh, Dom's been down here. I'm going to give that to you, Lazel. Sausage. I think Don's been down here doing a bit of murdering, I'm just saying. I can't believe Oren's actually shape-shifting as... I can't believe Oren is actually shape-shifting as Oren because she's actually dumb. <laughs> true, it's true. I was speaking with Dom earlier. He did call me his blood sibling and threatened to kill me. So maybe, maybe that's why. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Dom, Dom would never threaten violence on anyone. He's a good boy. Ugh. Cloud kill. Why is there cloud kill down there? There's a chest. <gasps> oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, I've got that that spell I could use, but do I have gust of wind? If I have a scroll of gust of wind, that would be way better. Sorry. Do you have gust of wind? You do have gust of wind. Rock on. Okay. Go down here, Astarian. Use Gust of Wind. Uh. Oh, I did like nothing. Ah, oh, hang on. Uh, Mage Hound. Hang on. No. Can I use Mage Hand to grab that chest? I don't know what I expected. <laughs> Summon Scratch, you say? What do you think, chat? Get scratched to go down there and get the chest. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Do I have any poison resistance potions? I do. All right. Okay, I'm gonna give one of these to uh, Halson. What is needed? No sub rep, treat my head, my head, lol. Some scratch right in the kill cloud, he's sick in me, yeah. Okay, we're gonna go get that chest. Alson's gonna take some damage, but you'll be fine. 
Nice return base mode. Nice. There's like fuck all in here. Indeed. Get out of there, Halson. Get out of there. Also, what do you mean, no sub rep? Shake my head, my head. Gale exists. Still alive. So that's progress. <laughs> Time to press ahead. <laughs> Gale is a subby <laughs> Can't give up now. What's down here? What's down here? Then it's going to do some herbalism. Gale's manipulative and gross. Yeah. Isn't he great? <laughs> no good sub rep, right? Fair, 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 fair. I'm gonna make some psychic resistance potions. I'm gonna make five of them. Crap. Oh, muddy goo! I'm gonna make all of them. Nice. And one of these. One of these. Nice. Okay, let's go into this cave now. I actually don't know what's in here. There's rocks here. Oh, did this collapse behind us? There's bloody footprints. We need to be going this direction. They do just disappear. Hmm. Go this way. I don't know where we are right now. Murgrass. Don't mind if I do. We're like out in the countryside. What the fuck? <gasps> That's a boaty woaty. Where the fuck are we? Belladonna? I barely know her. It's like a broken down ship here, look at this. Heavy chest. Let's have a look. Just like me. Oh, my clown face paint got wiped off because of the water here. Boo, I say, boo. No, Starin, you require the clown face paint more than anybody. This feels like where the Illithid uh, ship crash in Act 1. Yeah, it really does, doesn't it? Oh, it's locked. And... Trapped. Astarian? Easiest roll I've ever made. Should be easy. Easiest roll I've ever made. Excuse me, it's actually a naughty Lloyd. Look at this gold ring. Ocean's galore. Necklace of elemental augmentation. When one of your cantrips deals acid, cold, fire, lightning, or thunder damage, add your spell crack casting modifier to the damage dealt. That is really strong. Um, that's really good. Okay. Sturge. 
What's your current Jesus. necklace? Whenever you, the word deals damage with a ranged spell attack, look to reverberation. Yep, yeah, no, we're taking that. The, uh, this necklace is way, way better. Very strong. How much further can I go? Look at me making nerd jokes. Very Professor Growth. Heck yeah! Might be useful. It's almost basically a BG3 expert now. It's true. It's true. Ugh. Well, that's stinky. What's this steam cloud? Oh, that's mines! I'll throw a rock at it. By rock, I mean this dude. <laughs> it's very good. I wasn't expecting that. It just got me. Runs chalice. Nice. Whose statue is this? Big pile of rotten fish here and rotten bananas. Who is this? I wish there was a check, like a passive check that was made to it. I started paying way more attention once they started with the psychological themes. Yeah, definitely so. Alright, everyone, stand back. Stand back. The disarming experts on the case. First down is the hardest. Oh, shit! The thunder... De right. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I didn't like how many perception checks there were then. Whoosh! <laughs> oh man, Hilton! Okay. Good. Excellent, even. So good. What's going on here then, buddy? Dying Stone Lord Thug. Uh, my legs. I can't feel them. Tell the others. Let the boss know. This man is not long for this world. Who's your boss? Stone Lord. He'll saw this. He'll get him. You hear the blood gurgle in his struggling lungs. His last ounce of strength is spent. Die. Oh, that was very funny. Holy shit, man. Very good. Very, very good. I'm not liking all this trip wise I'm seeing there. Can we go up this way. Wooden box and a fresh corpse. Perception check failed. Not loving that. Oh, God. my lungs hurt from laughing at that. Holy shit. Fresh cost. 
a lot of dead guys here. The caffeinated. What's going on over here? That same ship was at Mirai's Towers, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, this is this is one of the ships on Moonrise. Looks like those two are about to fight. What's going on here? Nobody messes with the Stone Lord, Rattling. Nine Fingers sent her love, asshole. Your Stone Lord's a dead man walking. You, help me kill these asses. The girls will sprinkle you with gold. Uh... Who, wait, hang on, what? Oh, come on now, can't we resolve this with words? A round of flighting, perhaps. Are you serious? A pacifist in Baldur's Gate? <laughs> Nobody's leaving this place alive, cock. It's very good. This game's incredible. This is the interaction I told you about. That is absolutely true. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's the best game ever made by human hands. Oh, fuck me. Okay, so we've got a bunch of dudes in green clothes and a bunch of dudes in red clothes. No one's leaving here alive, cuck. Oh, because they're... Oh, I see. Let's see that blasting. 53 damage! 53 damage. Dragonborn spotted. Holy shit, there is a Dragonborn. Old Flake Eyes. It's me, I be Old Flake Eyes. My eyes are flaky. Just like the plans I make. One down. Smooch him. Okay. Hunt's mark on Halson. Psionic dominance. The enemy within 80 meters of you targets you with a spell of a level that is lower than or equal to your proficiency modifier, you can use your reaction to nullify the spell. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Counter spell, baby. Yeah, I don't need to do all that. He splashed me with acid. I'm going to start throwing my spear. Not my spear, my uh, thing. Trident. God, that's very, very good damage. I'm gonna get in there, do one melee attack. So I can use a cantrip as well. We can use Dissonant Whispers on Kairos. Wait, Kairos? Kairos, where do I name. It's Kairos, where do I know that name, name from? Must see the Dragonborn starts blasting. I'd be surprised if I didn't. I'd be surprised if I didn't already know about the d double reptile dick thing. Don't know what you're talking about. Don't know what you're talking about, mate. Time to strike. No idea what you're referring to. Oh, telekinesis! I'm gonna try this out. I haven't used this before. Oh, so you can just throw people at other people. That rocks. Okay, you're going way over here. That's so cool! That's so cool! Smash me with what? Smash me with my platonic juice. So true. 
not enough movement. That's okay. Uh, go over here. Ow! Oh, she threw a grenade! Shit, bro! I'm gonna yump over here. Oh my gosh. Incredible. We're going to rupture the ground. Doggy. Fat rip. Oh, shit. Arch ass, why doesn't house never crush me? Awful, 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 awful. Let's have advantage on the targets. Mm. Okay, we're gonna bonus action hide. Time for a new then we're gonna start blasting. And miss. That's fine. We're gonna miss. Nicely done, Nassarian. Very good, very good, very good. Stop shooting acid at my boy! That's big damage. I'm You're than a war roast. God damn, the extra damage output I'm getting from uh, Fish Mockery is great. Super fun. Okay, you are going over here. You're not going over there. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I didn't want them to go over there anyway. Okay, now play us some some powerful music, Lazel. Excellent. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's attacking he's attacking Helson. So we're gonna have to come over here. We're gonna have rage. Then we're gonna rupture. Amazing. Super good. That wasn't hugging me too hard and shattering my ribs. Awful. Oh, Dirge is hurt. Dirge is really hurt. Interesting. Using Healing Word and Lazy Animal healed her poor performance. That's very funny. <clears throat> Shit, man. I need this bozo to get away from me. Uh, I'll just engage. Outmaneuver them. Oh, flake eyes. And he missed again. 
Lazy Dog got your orders to just play the flute during combat and was dumbfounded that she just went with it. Oh, Dirge is hurt. Okay, I need you to chuck your thing there. And then... Oh, hang on, we can twin spell. Okay, so this is why I went Sorceress, to gain Twin Spell. We're going to cast Dissonant Whispers on this guy and on... this guy. Awesome. Yeah, Lazel, I need you to actually kill this guy, okay? Oh, holy shit! Does just bloodletting, he's balancing his humors. He is! He believes in old, old medical treatments? Okay, that's fine. Ah, I could have misty stepped over there. That's that's a shame. Alright. Okay, Halson is exposed. Not in a fun way. Wild shape. Oh, we got our new wild shape forms! Yes, Halson's exposed blushy face. Hmm. Is this chat just all innuendos? Yes. Like a good chat should be. Okay, we're gonna call lightning? Or do we wanna call lightning? It's a third level spell slot. Good ball. Oh, I don't have ball prepared? Really? Yeah, we're just going to lightning strike them. Quickly. Oh, he's so close to death. I don't have the spell prepared. Okay. Maybe I should. This is good. Killed them in one hit. Business as usual, folks. Business as usual. God damn, we killed a lot of people here today. I've only got one short rest left. If we need to use it. Enough sitting around. Let's go hurt someone. These guys have like nothing on them. How do people do this all day? That's not how you kiss flake guy. Shake my head, my head. It's true. Taste. Open up. Kairos. Where do I know the name Kairos from? Does anyone know, like like off the top of their heads. Kairos, Kairos, Kairos. Why? Mm. Kairos. Yeah, Cairo is in Egypt, but the name Kairos is from it's from a, a game or a show or something like that. Kairos. I 
Oh, is it tyranny? Hang on. Is it tyranny? Like... I don't know. Can't remember. <coughs> Corpse Grinder. Reliable and trustworthy, you could not hope for a more respectable company than this mall while traversing the forlorn places of the world. That's a very good weapon. That's actually really good. I'm going to give that to Lazel. Not to equip, but just to have. Kyra, like Egypt, hope this helps. God! Fuck. Can't believe you're all bullying me. Do not fail. The guild has caught wind of our activities down by the river. The Stone Lord has personally requested that you see off any visitors. I've heard rumorings that your dockside crew begin to doubt the tales of the Stone Lord's capabilities. Keep our shipment secure, and he will not need to come down in person to make a demonstration. Who's the Stone Lord? Stone Lord. Hmm. Oh, there's a dagger here. Oh, shit. The guy threw a powerful enchanted dagger at us. Gleam Dance Dagger. Oh, oh, okay. Offhand only weapon gives bonus to armor class. Interesting. Interesting. Guildmaster's orders. Nine fingers ain't backing down. Stonewall's pushing in on our enterprise, so she wants to push back on his. Find out why his fresh face why this fresh-faced shithead is so keen to clear a landing spot for the cult ships. Our bully must have into saving and pinning the fingerprints. Yes, speaking of which, I will save. <coughs> Remember to save, dumbass, yes. Right, I'm gonna head out tonight. Okay. I hope you have an excellent night's sleep, Foxy. Love you, big many, and sleep well. Hopefully, see you tomorrow for glugging down mayonnaise. Regards you lifelessly. Who are you? Falling from the guild. Who are you fighting? The Stone Lord's men. Interlude. <laughs> What were they here for? Don't know. Something valuable. Music's really good. Who's the Stone Lord? Fury. Threat to everyone. Not very helpful. What were you doing here? Seizing their hall for nine fingers. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more. When you get to the Mayo tomorrow, you gotta take a shot, Musty. I, I will. I've got uh, a bottle of cherry rum. I might have some of that. Or I might just have a big shot of um, mayonnaise. Archer Felicia. Regards you. So she's another guild Honestly. member based on her armor. Who are you? Infiltrated the guild. What? Wait, for real? Oh. Who are you fighting? What were you doing here? Observing. Spying. Disguised. What was the fight about? Territory. Control. Smuggling valuables. Okay. 
Even though the Harpers weren't 100% good. I mean, the Harpers are fine. Mind Flayer Parasite! If I do. Get that in my fucking head right now. This place of beast form would be very cool. I think it's kitty time. I think if I don't go kitty time now, uh, someone's literally gonna come and like, yeah, I, I did, I did, that's absolutely true. It's kitty time. If I don't go kitty time now, someone's gonna come and assault me. It's cat time, cat boy time. Oh, get that worm in my head. Delicious, Co my compliments to the chef. Where's the PNG tuber cat is? Uh, that's a very good question. I'll need to commission Voxy to do that. Fossilized shell. Mergrass. I will send my Mr. of Tickle Arms over the Atlantic, but not tuck you in. Excuse me? So the Stone Lord's men are uh trying to smuggle in brainworms? Yes! They are! Oh that's so many brainworms! Annotated ships manifest. A ship's manifest. Amid the mundane goods, a specific unit of crates have been circled with a note on the top. Reminder. The Stone Lord's goods. We don't need to see the man to know he's serious about his property. If you're tempted to crack a crate and take a look, remember Naren. The wide-eyed loons who came to take him away last time. Sorry, remember Naren? And the wide-eyed loons who came to take him away last time? I didn't raise a finger to stop those, m those God's mad bastards. I won't do it for you either. Okay. Let's have a look. Just another crate. Blood banks. Blood banks. Bag of rotten food. Music here is really good. Arrow of salving. Arrow of Ilmater. Oh, look at all the ships! Okay. Is Stone Lord someone someone we know? We should know. Um uh, only if you've played a lot of Dungeons and Dragons. We we have no way of knowing who the Stone Lord is in this game. So far. What's up here? Oh, we got brain worms. Oh, it's getting in my skull. Absorb intellect would be very handy to have. Fracture psyche would also be very nice. Charm is the one that least appeals to me. We've already got psionic dominance. We're gonna take absorb intellect. I'm gonna go for mind sanctuary. Okay, I'm gonna remove some things from this hot bar. I'm gonna remove this. I remove disengage. I remove dip. I remove hide because I think it's hot keyed. Yeah. Remove help because that's contextual. Remove jump because we've got flight. 
Remove shove, because I think that's a default thing. Yes, it is. Remove throw, because that's default. Play D&D. Excellent question. It's me. I will play D&D. I fucking love D&D. That game's great. What's in here? Passageway? No to Kairos. Boss, I found this out on a poor schmuck. This isn't from the stash... I'm not Van, I know the rules. Posh necklace. Interesting. I played D&D if it had Halson in it. True. Oh, D&D's good. Portal Sherry. I didn't mean to drink it! I was trying to pick it up. I didn't mean to just immediately glug it down like some sort of hungry pigeon. Wish I had a bag of holding. How long does it take to beat D and D? Um, depends on how quickly you confess up your DM. Who D and A? Rice, cheese, and gravy, a perfectly balanced meal. Delicious. That implies that there are Canadians in this world. Look at all these paintings. Wow. Wow. I'm taking all of them. Very cool. A trail. What's oh, a dead beat Someone here? Like Paris is warning. Seems like Van needed to be reminded that you don't take from the stash. The stash is mine, and you get what I give you. I find you taking from the stash, you end up like Van. Be smart. Don't be like Van. That implies the Quebecois are also here. It's true. The Quebecies. Easy roll. Easiest roll of my life. Bone Spike Boots. Base of Instinct. You have a plus one bonus to armor class and saving throws as long as you're not wearing armor or holding a shield. Well, that's Carlax. That's, that's for Carlax. That's going to base. That's going to base right now. Send to camp. How many die today? How many die tomorrow? Thank you, Dirge. Bit of gold. Oh, I just realized something. We don't have um, Lazel wearing some new armor. Hang on. Never wanted the easy path. I just remember we got Catherick Thorne's arm and we didn't give it to uh Lazel. Reap's embrace, yeah. Action. Action. Open up. Okay. Reap's embrace compared to Adamantine Splint Armor. All damage reduced by two, good. Intense adamantine backlash. Ten times reeling. Can't be critically hit. Can't be critically hit is really good. It's really, really strong. I think I mean Catholic's first suit. I, I beg your pardon. You're, you are correct. 
I can't believe I'd be so foolish as to make a mistake like that. Oh, holy shit, she looks metal as fuck! Okay, that's a strong look. That is a fucking powerful look. That does mean that she's vulnerable to crits again. Maybe the Grim Skull helmet would be good, but the circuit of psionic vengeance is pretty good. We succeed a saving throw. Pretty good. That's pretty good. Gee, Asaron, why do you get six bonuses? Because he's my poor little meow meow. He is. Okay, we're gonna take off the circlet, even though it's very good. We're gonna replace it with the Grim Skull helmet. Nice. <laughs> right. What boots does she have? Boots of comfort and... Hey, that's not very good. Wait, hang on. Would this stack with, um... Halsin? With Halsin's wild shape? I'm gonna give this to Halsin. I'm gonna do a bit of experimentation. We're going to try something out. So I think we're actually maybe going to take a long rest in a second. A long rest in a sec. There's a target dummy around here somewhere, right? Where's the target dummy? Oh, shit! It's Dirge's statue! True hero of Baldur's Gate. Just look at those cheekbones. Gazing upon this depiction of themselves will bless the owner of the statue once per long rest. That's really good. What's the train dummy? I see something that I can hit. I shall handle this. I'm Halston. I will handle this. This is where the magic mirror is. It's not what I'm looking for, though. Do we not have a target dummy? I would have thought for certain that we did. Remember to big potion house after long rest. I shall do. Hmm. Hmm. Do we really not? Okay. No, it's fine. It's fine. What boots does he currently have? He doesn't have boots. He might as well just wear these then. Might as well wear them. Wicked. Excellent. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. All is ash and meat. Where it deals an additional 1d4 damage with thrown attacks and attacks made with improvised weapons. Hmm. Hmm. Nice. Seeing these stables makes me think we should have bought the ooze disguised in an ox to camp. Yeah. The ooze is awesome. Only other person who maybe would understand the urge. Have to keep going. Nothing What's down here anymore. What's down here? Walnuts? I love walnuts. 
and a piece of melon, and a bottle of delicious booze. Potatoes, incredible. We need those. The Ooze was one of my favorite NPCs. Yeah, really, really good character. Unironically, very good. Smuggler's Manifesto. The rules, don't forget. Stick to the Sword Coast if you don't want to trigger an all-out war and draw attention of the higher-ups of the council. No backstabbing, no ratting, no stealing from each other. Once you get what you're given, no skimming off the top. Trust that you'll get your share. Highest value goods come first. Don't go shuffling bread if there's a jewel rush. We're not a bakery. Keep the camp tidy. We don't want anyone to follow a trail of gold back to us. Hmm. Evil feather. Apples! I'll take that. Common table wine, don't mind if I do. Delicious. The forgotten one is remember to have fun. Yeah. I'm tired of being evil. I just want to chill and be fed by Damon. Yes. Silk root. Tell no one. A map pointing to a secret breach in the wall of Worms Rock Fortress. It looks like it could lead to the prison, and from there, the inside of the fortress itself. Interesting. Ball. Oh. Gonna play fetch house it? Interesting. I'm going to send this clown torso to camp, along with this hand. They're very heavy. Okay, let's go for a stroll. What do we get back? Oh, it's this way. Okay. I was wondering, my, my brain was getting tricked by the rock base there. I think, actually, you know what? No, we are going to long rest now. We're going to long rest now. Because I think we're going to long rest and maybe actually wrap up the stream. I didn't realize it's as late as it was. It's nearly uh, 4 a.m. Um, so when does the random boulder in our path reveal itself to be R in this? True. The, the boulder shapeshifts and it's like, poor little flesh thing. Okay, we're going to long rest. We're going to take a long rest, folks. I'm going to end the day. Yana, I'm going to talk to Yana. Discussion. I brought my own paring knife. Now I just need some ingredients, and I'm going to make something really good. I promise. I bet you will. Grub. Oh, I love this cat. I'm going to drink a potion of animal speaking. Just a cat. P -p Please talk to Yenna. I'm not going to hurt you, Kitty. I d -d don't like talking. Is Yenna mistreating you? Y Yenna is my best friend. She's kind. H help her, not me. May I pet you? P -p Please don't. Okay. Do you know what happened to Yenna's mother? N nothing good, I don't think. She was so very sick. M maybe she made like a cat and went off to, to spend a last life. Oh, fuck me, man. That sucks. That sucks, man. Well, Guess I'm a dad now. Hey, Trevor. Good to see you, man. 
Welcome. Yeah, nah. I brought my own paring knife. Okay, no further dialogue there. That's good, that's good, that's good. Does anyone have anything to say before we long rest? Lazel? I'm listening. Nope, nothing, nothing new. Oh, Will? I have battled great evils, been mocked by villains of all sorts, but Orin, she is beyond even Thorm. Her mind is twisted beyond recognition. What is she capable of? And where will she strike next? We're nearing the city. Are you excited to return? Reluctant? A little bit of both? Baldur's Gate is where I first raised a glass in toast at the tender age of 14 and got so tipsy from wine, I puked in Dillard Portier's bushes. It's where the flaming fist chased me after I'd stolen a peach from a cart in the wide. I got a good chewing out over it too. It's where my father taught me to hold a rapier, to read books of law, to know right from wrong. It's been seven years since I left. It's no paradise. But it's home, and it's worth saving. That was really nice. Thank you, Bill. Anything else? Well, Ned. No, absolutely nothing. You don't need to apologize, Trevor. You're okay. Shot! Orin's little display was just intended to rattle us. We mustn't let her succeed. We need to stay alert all the same. You mentioned that Shah followers might be watching for us. You think we can use them to track down your parents? I hope so. So long as I'm willing to stroll right into the Mother Superior's trap, they have no reason to not tell me where to go. What should we be looking for? Worms Crossing is a choke point. If I wanted to intercept a new arrival, I'd find somewhere before the bridge, blend in amongst the crowds, and wait. Right. We, fa we found that guy. The city will be refugees. I'd look wherever they're gathering. Yeah. So it's that guy that uh, that he was looking for Shadow Heart. All's well, I hope. Aside from the obvious. Okay. Uh... Gale? Or in toys with us where she could destroy us. Whatever her motivations, I hope she reveals them quickly. Okay. Dog! Hope you're keeping well, friend. Yeah, I am. Come here. I'm covered in viscera. I had a dinosaur explode earlier. Grub and Yenna are my darling children whom I love dearly. Well, got a little bit of story out of that piece of cardboard. Poor Will, we need to season him a bit. Yeah, I think Will just needed more time in the oven. Like, it makes me sad. Will's, Will's, I, I, like, Will's in theory really cool, but he, he, he just needed more development, I think. Alson. Oak Father preserve you. Oak Father preserve you. Have we heard from Thandil since we moved on? I have. <laughs> he speaks to me during my nightly meditations. He is well, and Oliver also. At times they are one, and at others they divide. Easier for playing, perhaps. And the land thrives also. I doubt you would recognize it. Perhaps one day, you and I can both return and see it for ourselves. Yeah, that'd be nice. I'd like that. How am I holding up in your estimations? I've been unfair to you. I've had unrealistic expectations of your character ever since I joined you. What does that mean? Honestly, you've surpassed even those. Oh! It seemed my faith was more than well-founded. Okay, thank you. Will is a human fighter core, straight man d and core. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel you. Okay. Um, we're going to talk to Asarian. Hello, my dear. 
Hello. Carlac. What's on your mind? Oh, I forgot that she was going to be wearing the clown makeup. I forgot. <laughs> About our relationship, Carly. Go on. Are you happy with how things are between us? If you're happy, I'm happy. Are you happy? Yeah, I'm happy. Deliriously. Couldn't have said it better myself. Okay. Leave. Uh right, we're gonna. We're going to take our long rest. Oh, it's time for a little snooze. It's time for a little sneezy woozy. Oh, look at this. We've, um... We've actually got beds this time. We've got, like, hay bales with our sleep rolls on them, rather than, like, sleep rolls just being, like, on the floor. That rocks. The clown makeup stays on during sex. Look, I'm all here for the clutzy. You have no idea. You have no idea. Me risen car like up to have her keep the 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 clown makeup on, being like, please, 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 please. <laughs> right, let's go to bed. We're gonna eat a hamster and horseradish and sausage. And mint, and a fish, more sausage, and potatoes, and walnuts, and poutine, and melon, and some spiced rum, and apple, and uh... desert wine. Wait, is that desert wine or dessert wine? Dessert wine, I beg your pardon. And a clown makeup to Mustard's fetish list. Fair. That's full rest, folks. That's full rest. <coughs> naughty, 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 little master. No. What? Disobeyed your father's wishes one time too many. For he who fights with monsters should look to it that he himself becomes a monster. When you gaze long into the abyss, the abyss also gazes into you. Embrace what you have rejected, and that other will be your death. But your father loves you dearly. Holy fuck! Slaughter your line. Become the last of your name. Lord Baal shall have but one choice. <gasps> Memories flood back, snatches of your story written in the blood of a thousand Fuck. victims. Years spent in worship of Baal, leading his savage congregation in prayer, <gasps> sacrifice, and slaughter. You were their master, and he was yours. Uh. A true master, a dread lord, a devoted father. All is as you feared. You are a spawn of Baal. Yes, yeah, that's so cool! Yes, 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 yes! Okay, okay. I need to be clear about this. I had suspicions about this for a really, 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 really long time. I had, like, I had a sneaking suspicion. Because in Baldur's Gate 1 and 2, you play as a Baal spawn. Right? Spoiler alert for Baldur's Gate 1 and 2. But you play as a Baal spawn, right? Um, 
And I thought it was really, really weird on my Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough that we weren't playing Ball Spawn, right? But that's what the dirge is. Dark Urge is a fucking Ball Spawn. Fuck so hard. Holy shit. Oh my god, I need a cigarette after that. Holy fuck! Oh. Recall that there was an. Okay, so interesting. What are the implications of being a Baal spawn? Okay. So, the thing with Baal spawn is that Baal is a god who basically is not particularly strong, right? He's, he's not a particularly strong god. But his way of increasing his strength was to have kids who would then commit mass murder strengthening themselves, and they would then offer themselves a sacrifice to Baal. So the, the idea is that Baal just consumes the world in order to further his own strength. Baal's the god of murder, and everything's suddenly making a lot more sense. As being Baal's born, it's literally like... The, it's the will of Baal, like, pushing us to do things. Fuck! <laughs> Someone says, I suppose we're all Baal spawn. Awful, awful, awful. Go sit in the corner and think about what you've done. Uh, I'm gonna click fourth. Recall that there was another, the woman who became the Slayer. You are not the last of your name. Not yet. There is another. The abomination wrapped in flesh you saw in the colony. Orin, it's time for a family reunion. But be wary of your confessors. Your friend turned to foe, knowing what you are. Shit, man. Fuck! I don't know what to say. Um, that's really, really cool, and it's it's opened up so much about who we are. Bell says, friend turned to foe, not, why not friend turned to foe? Awful. I hate to cut into this emotional revelation, but please, please, big potion. <laughs> oh, in like five seconds, someone. I'm coming down from a huge revelation. But okay, fine. What lies within? Holy shit. Ball spawn. This is a big potion, right? Yeah. He big! He big! He big! Yeah, hello, little ball spawn. It's going to be the will of Baal that we kill Aaron. It is Aaron's de it's our destiny that one of us dies. T 
giant king checks. True. If not over, then through. Hmm. Sorry, I've got a lot to think about there. I've got a lot on my mind, and well, in it. Ah. Okay, that. I keep hearing Gruff's little meows. I don't know whether that's grub or whether or not that's like a bird somewhere. Like that little meow sound. Right, um. We're gonna save here. We're gonna save and we're gonna wrap up. Um. This was nuts. I. When I came on tonight, I was expecting just like clown time. I wasn't expecting the reveal of what the urge is. I think. We're going to need to do some thinking about who we tell. Someone says, I have three things I care about. House and being large, cute little cat, and finally the dirge stuff. Yeah. This rocks. This rocks so fucking much. So, Oren's ball spawn as well. And it's potentially... Why? If if we were the one leading Baal's cult and Aaron overthrew us, which is kind of the implication that I got there, then Hmm. How long have we worked together for? How long do we know each other? Us being at the head of a cult of Baal is incredibly troubling to think about. Incredibly troubling. But very cool. Very, very fucking cool. Mm. Right. We're gonna wrap up here. There's, there's too much, to, there's a lot to think about. I need to digest this. Because I really need to think about if we're gonna tell our companions that we're actual Baal spawn. Because uh, <laughs> it might not go down particularly well. Um, yeah, we're going to wrap up here. We're going to save. We're going to pin everything. And we're going to come back to this another time. We're going to come back to this next week. Okay? Holy crap! Okay. Um, that rocks. What a... Incredible. Incredible. Alright, we're going to wrap up here. I'm going to throw up the thanks for watching screen. And for realsies, thank you so much for tuning in today. This was this was a big one. This is a really, really big stream. I just want to wish you all an excellent night. Hope you all have a really, really good Tuesday night. Um, we'll be streaming again tomorrow, but we're not going to be streaming Boulder's Gate. We're going to be streaming Stardew Valley, doing a bit of speedrunning. Yeah, we'll catch you tomorrow. All right, folks. See you later. Bye bye.